Oh, oh, oh we're, we're live? Oh, God. Oh, why, why didn't anyone tell me, Quinty? Why did you oh. let me go for it? You should have stopped me. I was trying to get myself as much calories as possible so I could be as hype as possible for the plus R matches that we have going on here tonight. And thank you all for joining us for some plus R. How you doing, T5? Oh, I'm doing great. I mean, I'm always excited for these Boston Blue Beat Weeklies. Uh, the plus R uh, brackets they've been running have been just so amazing lately. Entrance have been up. The quality of the matches has been better pretty much every week, I want to say. Mm -hmm. And so, I, I, as you said, make sure you've got your food. Make sure you've got your beverage. Cliff isn't on the screen, so you don't have time for a bathroom break yet. We got ev <laughs> We have everything we need to have a great bracket. And look, we're opening up with Robokai vs. Soul. Look at Jesus. that. Jesus. <laughs> what if I have a Cliff bar, by the way? Is that, does that count? Is oh, yeah. Screen, that's then? perfect. That's great okay, calories. Excellent. Yeah. Cool then I'm perfectly ready for the bracket that we have here tonight. And we have a lot of killers tonight. I feel like uh, the TNS kind of like revitalized some of the energy in the scene as well. Because as you mentioned, North America has gotten very, very good in like uh, much more recent times. Like the last year or so has really yes. been reestablishing like the quality of plus R within the States. And I think just with TNS last week, people were like, well, I want to play a little bit more. I want to play some more. So uh, people are really uh, getting into it. Yeah, I think the international competition in fighting games, ever since the advent of, like, common rollback online solutions in, in modern games, has been just, like, it's, it's blossomed, it's bloomed into something so beautiful. Just the quality of play everywhere has just skyrocketed up, because people are finally able to, you know, not even just internationally, but, like, across their own continent, practice right. and, and, and problem solve and learn. Mm -hmm. And that kind of convenience is not was not always offered in, in places in North America, just due to, like, you know, not just the infrastructure and, like, the distance, but just the network connection and all that kind of stuff, you know? Mm hmm And now it's, like, we are starting to see some pockets of, like, emerging uh, player groups and everything like that. Now that it's, like, well, we don't have to travel, like, you know, the 30 minutes to an hour to get to one another on, like, a weeknight or something like that. Uh, yeah. I see a lot more pings going around just saying, hey, you know, can we get some games going here? I have some free time. You want to play for 30 minutes? And people are just filling out those small gaps of time with as many games as possible, and that's just legitimately impressive. Oh, yeah. The grind is so real in this game. And speaking of real, let's open up right now. We got Gansa on the left. He's rocking soul. We got Circuit Sturgeon rocking Robokai on the XCOM alien controller. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> you have been talking ages about that controller. Oh, my God. They're both blue, too. Whoop. You're not kidding about the alien factor going on in here. No, yeah. He's 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 really, really familiar. The thing that Circuit Sturgeon really loves to do is, is build his heat up as high as possible and maintain it for as long as possible. Since that's where Robokai's buttons and specials just get way more powerful. Uh, okay, so he's looking to kind of maintain that very high level uh, heat, trying to keep yourself like as high tier as possible, as long as possible. It is working great so far. Yeah, I like this control. Oh, here we go. Soul's turn now. Oh, that was a great bait on the DP. Uh, that, this is going to be a game of them DP, DP baiting each other. That's what we've seen so far. There's a bunch of DPs coming out here. I kind of feel like Cam went for a DP there too. Oh, oh, yo! oh, oh. He was ready, he was ready for it. He was ready. Arse! Why are there Oh, oh, oh no! I got, I got a little too excited. I can feel it though. Like, oh my god! Everybody I feel the excitement. Me. I'm excited too. Nice to block there. Just using the FD to make sure they don't get yeah, tipped out. But yeah. oh, the anti-air missile. People, yeah, people always. It, it's very easy to forget. You have to FD that in the air, despite yeah. the fact that it's a projectile that goes up. It is very strange, but very neat. Yeah, make, makes you think in like the worst ways possible here. Yeah. I like that 2K2S. I was actually worried it wouldn't connect, but I think a lot of characters are wider when they're crouching and hit stun. So if you <laughs> notice that, you can actually 2S a little bit further out. Ooh, what a target! All right, and great oh. confirm as well. But yeah, you, like that whole spacing aspect there is going to be very, very strong when coming into this matchup here and trying to keep goodness. you know Gantt as much as possible. But down geez. Under five. That's wow, cool. the confirm oh. off of Gantt was really good, and the DP once again the disrespect from Circus Sturgeon is going wild right now. That's coming back. Oh, yeah. nice gauge. Just jump right over it. No problem. Jump over the missile. Coward. Yeah, one of the big things for, for Robokai 2 is trying to navigate around Soul's presence on the ground. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh, what? Oh, that was so firm. Oh, oh no, the weight fell a little faster than she was expecting, I think. Good yeah. stabilization at the end, though. Picked it up. 
Yeah, that was still like the fact that you confirmed off of that was really, really good. Like I've been impressed by the conversions from Gant and the actually sheer disrespect from Sturgis Sturgeon. Oh like, yeah, like, yeah. Really you, you want to try and run your strike throw? You better start establishing the strike out of my DP range first, right? Oh, there it is. Yep, exactly. <laughs> and we even saw like an attempt for a throw there, and then went right back to strike again. These IDs are really good. Nice JS. Yeah, that was clean. Right, Circus, Circus at the point where they can't trade quite as much health because these stray hits are going to add up. Robo does not have a high guts value. Oh! Ooh, wow, JS actually stopping that cleanly. And then we got another one, baby. Let's go. You know, I didn't think I'd ever see a Robo Soul match where Robo did more DPS than Soul. Right? And it's, <laughs> it's not like Gas not trying either. <laughs> yeah, no, it's just the opportunities haven't been there. Like, oh no, the overheat. Uh oh, my <laughs> oh part of my play. plan, Goku. <laughs> yeah. Oh! They got hit on purpose. Oh. Okay. okay, yeah, I, I had was, enough meter anyway, but I was expecting some of the Circus Sturgeon really likes the uh the multi-shot 16. Mm -hmm. I was expecting him to maybe dial that in a little bit more there to catch that 5k, because I think it would have would have counter hit it. Right? I actually think so too. I was like, oh, will that 5k hit there? <laughs> yeah, I felt I felt it. Alright. There was a moment of fear. All right, this has actually been a pretty active match. Like, neither of them can, like, really establish a game plan because they were just disrespecting each other on Oki as much as possible. Yeah, there's just been, like, a ton of scrambles. Like, they get a knockdown, and it almost feels like they're just resetting the neutral but with, like, a, a timer. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and it's, like, all, like you said, it's all part of the plan, Goku. <laughs> exactly. Robokai, like you, you really have to operate like that when you're playing Robokai. You have to think Oof. pretty far ahead. Because your guard bar fills up fast. You have to manage your heat. you got to manage your meter. <laughs> Like, exactly. <laughs> Sorry. No, it's okay. Each other yep, over yep. And over. That's... I make it sound really intelligent, and then it's like, okay, we're gonna press 6 2 3 H and we get knocked down. I think I figured right. it out. Oh, oh! Big call out. That was so good. Oh, that was amazing as well. Oh, nice far slash. That's a perfect spacing on that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, there we go. The next level of DP has arisen here, being the cream of the crop to the top. We got the nice little overhead there. The technical fastest overhead in the game. Yes. Like eight frames. <laughs> One frame faster than Bikens. Take that, top tier. Oh, yeah. oh Nice pickup. Wow, yeah, gonna build some meter. Well. Oh. Oh, right. yeah. Recognizing that Robo was a little low there. I like it. He's backing off. Take the knockdown. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, there we go. Big bait. Oh, the yeah, Shadow Slice Vector Burst! Oh my it. god. Oh my goodness. The He's disrespect so did not stop with the DP. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh! Oh, oh. Oh, that was sick. Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, fine. no, no. Fine. Okay. Okay, do it again. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's a hard position. I understand Circuit Sturgeon's hesitation. Entering Soul when he's right above you as Robo is really difficult without, like, a hard commitment with DP. Mm-hmm. Oh no, Grum Reaper! Ooh. Oh, but now Circuit has the corner! Yeah, I was gonna say, the one thing that can beat the, the 6P is just going lower. <laughs> <laughs> True! If there's any character that could do it. Well, it's Milia or Abba, but also Soul. Oh! Oh, oh my god, nice! Uh, that was very, very cool here. DP's over once again. Why jump when you could DP, honestly? Exactly! Fuzzy jump? Nah, fuzzy Ooh. DP. Fuzzy DP. They approach, you hit them. <laughs> Yeah, there it is. Oh! Nice. It's gonna hurt. Oh! oh. Robokai's weight is kind of weird, because he's got the combination of that heavy weight and also Kai's kind of unfavorable hurt block. So Soul mm -hmm. can get- Oh, what a throw! Oh, that was good! That's it! Yeah, I like... from Kanto. Yeah, but I was gonna say, like you were saying, like, the, the weight on Robokai is a little bit of an oddity there. Uh, but honestly, Gante has been doing a very good job mm -hmm. maintaining like a lot of the combos. Like we saw the uh, five piece earlier, leading into knockdown afterwards. So Robokai is not a popular character. So the fact that they have that on deck was insane. Yeah, really, really good awareness, and just knowing when to kind of back off and let it, let it, let the chips fall. Right. Sometimes mm -hmm. you get those hits, and you're like, I could go for this combo, but it might put me in like a really bad situation, tech wise, meter wise positionally because if you get like a bad hit sidewinder they're going to tech right over you and you're going to be right next to them because you're aiming for that clean hit and if they right. tech over you and you're now in the corner you're just kind of like playing from a strictly worse position mm -hmm. and that's just never good as soul you want to maximize your your meter and your efficiency because 
if you get pushed out, you might never get a chance to get back in. Right. Maybe not right. against Robokai, but like as a general rule, you want you really want to treat your opportunities, you know, as what they are, high value. Mm hmm. And uh, you know, Gante was at least making you know damn well sure that they were getting back in with a lot of riot stance yeah, exactly. and everything like that. And uh, actually, pretty good positioning on gun flames when things kind of cooled off for a little bit to make sure it's like, okay, I might not be getting in, but you also are not getting in. So great position there as well. Mm -hmm. All right, we got Hostel. Okay, so Hoss Slayer, this is a... Uh... Hmm. So from everything I hear from the Hoss players, this is a very, very challenging matchup. Mm-hmm. Because, you know, Hoss generally excels at, like, right up close in your face, slugging it out with, like, plus frames. But he's not generally doing strictly gapless pressure. Right. He's got, like, these little gaps that you can't really hard challenge, but Slayer has maybe the best way of dealing with that, which is, you know, BDC bite, BDC jump. Mm-hmm. Because Haas already is not the greatest at dealing with Fuzzy Jump in all situations. Oh, nice throw! Oh my god, that was clean. Uh, sorry, Andrew, I'm wrong. Oh, <laughs> nice rebuy there. I like that. Run back in, just hold the ground. Nice! nice oh my god! Again. These air throws from Andrew have been really good. Yeah, this is actually coming really clean so far. Nice! Oh my god! Egg, level 2! Utilizing! That is zero! Oh, oh, no. <laughs> no oh my god! Yo, Where are you Andrew going? Is bringing the do and doing the do right now against Yuri. Holy cow! Yeah, that was a beautiful Savage Bang. That is zero frames post flash. Mm -hmm. So if Yuri was doing anything that wasn't blocking before that super freeze, they're getting hit. Yeah, and they got hit indeed. They did. But like every also like J agents like you know the air, air throws have been very clean as well. Very yeah. aware of like the almost what I would call like a mimic of the what I would call the X Phantom style where X Phantom has seen the game for so long they kind of know okay here's what your options are and here's what you're going to do and it kind of covers both options and situations yeah it feels like Andrew's really copying that yeah X Phantom is a very much play by feel type of player mm -hmm. and that can be really really strong on hot oh <gasps> my god oh my god nice bait okay gold burst here we go Slayer with 100 meters yes! oh! let's go okay. this time oh not quite what a throw! All right, here we go. And that's a wall throw, chance. too. Oh, no. Did okay. not get the combo right for the weight. Ah! <laughs> what do you mean? Holy cow. Yo, what a oh big my... play from your... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 6 H to God. Uh-oh. Might not be AC, but that JH still coming down. Mm -hmm. The hammer of God. Oh, catches him low with that 2H. Nasty, nasty button. Oh, jump IB, very good, but... <gasps> okay, takes the charge, takes the charge. Yeah, uh, yeah, that was tough. clean. All right, now we're affirming here into the ground. Let's see if we can do a knockdown here, because we've been seeing some DPs. <gasps> oh, no! I was going to say, we've been seeing some DPs from Andu, but uh, I was wondering if I was going to be able to cover that just a little bit this time, but no. Oh, no, oh, the my God. Nice chance. Very aware of the screen position. <laughs> <laughs> I would be so mad. I would be so mad. <laughs> Just swings for it. No! Yes. <laughs> Yuri, thank me. Like, oh, I've seen this before. I know I can just I'm punch ready. this. Pile yeah. bunker. Pile bunker. It's so unfortunate uh, that that hit at a gun blaze. And that is a really strong yeah. tool for Haas. Not in counter hit state during the move. And if you hit him too late during it, the fire pillar is still gonna spawn. So if you're right. in like a situation like that, you're just gonna, it's a really bad trade. Yeah, it's one of those situations that you're like, well, I made the right decision and I lost. <laughs> yeah, you're just like, dang it. But nonetheless, you're doing a very good job. Yuri making sure to stay in and keep the pressure on nice despite throw. Andrew's ability to confirm and do high damage stuff. Like Yuri's really actually keeping it down. Oh, that was oh. a great rocket. I was like, I know you're going to BDC try to make some space back and shimmy. Yeah, rocket will cover it all, baby. Oh, oh no, not again! Is. The goal! <gasps> That's... Oh, like that Fafnir is really tricky in this matchup. It's because it's just got... It, it has, I think, one or two active frames. It's very yeah. little. And, you know, Slayer's backdash. Infamous for... Oh, wanted to make him a punish. Infamous for, like, not existing, honestly. <laughs> yeah. That's what makes it strong. Oh! oh! All right. It's oh, late. Yeah, gets into the there. Nice never bite again here from Yuri. Now going on match point. FTC bite putting in a lot of work there. Nice 2S. Yeah. I don't know what that was supposed to be, but it won. <laughs> oh! Maybe looking for like JH or JP. Ah, true. Good point. 
Although, yeah, you know, Andy does not actually jump a whole, whole lot in neutral. Yeah, he, he hasn't really established that at round start, but, you know, against Haas, it's always safe to assume. That's that jump true. Is so good. Yeah, you could be wrong, and that could be the end of your entire game. Nice bite. Oh, uh, oh, yeah, maybe expecting the backdash cancel, but mm -hmm. Yuri was just not in a bad situation, honestly, at that point, because it's like, well, I'm not in the corner. You're not walking me into a corner at all. I don't really have to press any buttons until you show me you're ready to do something on Oki. That's very dangerous. Yeah, it's tough. Well played to both players. That was a great set. Yeah. Andu, that, Andu came out exploding in that first match. Right, that was... That was like probably one of the cleanest rounds I've seen in a long time from Yeah, Andrew I think that if they round. if they could have kept hold of that momentum and that like that decision making pace, I think they could have they could have ran away with the set. Mm hmm But they, and, they slowed down a little bit in some really key areas and it and it hurt. Yeah. And it might be one of those things that you like you a round goes too well and you think they're not going to fall for that same trick again, so I'm going to change it up now so that they don't you know, they don't try to fool me early in the next match and it's like they just don't need to at that point you just took all your options off the table so they're like cool i guess i get to play now and that's exactly. what they do afterward all right we have <laughs> jack wachter versus peter and now this is me johnny oh my god okay i'm oh, sorry going chip today sorry, Peter, going chip. sorry excuse me so, yeah. okay, Peter will either knock Jack down and tickle him to death, or Jack will hit Peter and he'll die. Yeah. <laughs> but both are very exciting, just trust mm -hmm. me. And uh, one thing I can say about Jack, Jack's very good at hitting the opponent, like with very high rewarding stuff. Like, just kind of case in point here, just chips away with a lot of dolphins, just really mixes it up by jumping in front of them, and covers a lot of options like kind of like, you know, a bar match, basically, is what I would call yeah. it. Yeah. Jack Wachter will very effectively swing at you. And mm -hmm. if you're not prepared for how he's swinging, you're gonna get like frazzled. So I gotta see how Peter handles it. Right. These two have probably played all. <laughs> <laughs> all, right. all right. Okay. That confirm made Miku very happy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I would. I feel very vocaloid about that. Oh, 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 Peter! Looking for the tech chase the air throw there. Ooh. Nice. That's, wow. Nice. That was a really deep confirm. Yeah. Holy crap. That game of blade reaching out there as a confirm and going off of that. Peter is definitely ready. Peter's very powered up today. He's, he's prepared. Oh, what a, Did he just 6P that 2S? Oh I think so, actually. I'm like reviewing that back in my head. Like, God, yeah. Ew. Wow. <laughs> All right. Looking like the missing link. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, delayed records there. Trying to open up Jack just a little bit more. But the dolphin sails right over. But Jack is not staying in the corner, which is very, very strong. You know, it's funny too, I was like, I was gonna comment on Jack's burst, and then I looked at the health, and I was like, yeah, Jack's actually playing from a somewhat safe position right now. Mm-hmm. He really just wants to avoid getting hit by any one of Chip's really big starters. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> my case in point, Jack is very good at doing just a hit, like getting a hit. Ouch. Oh. For the beta belly, you can bet it all, baby. Oh, like not quite. Here. Ooh, I was actually an okay trade, but the life difference is looking a little dicey. Oh no, a dolphin over him. Yeah. Jack, Jack's just waiting. Yeah, they're respecting each other just a little bit more here. I think Peter's just waiting for an opportunity to get back in very safely. Oh, that. Oh, uh, but misses the punish. That's unfortunate. Oh no, that 3k is so minus, but just it, sometimes it's really hard to get that dash up punish. What? <laughs> oh yes, the hand raise. Yes, teacher, I would love to go next. I would love to take my turn. Thank yeah, you. Did you know that that uh, hoop move does, in fact, have upper body involved? Oh, here we go. Yes, because I get keep getting hit by it. <laughs> yeah, it's chilling. It's chilling. Nice block on all that rest of it, but wow. the dolphin's still there. Yeah, Peter actually not going in afterwards. Recognizing that the dolphin is still there was very, very smart. This is tricky, because he's really, he cannot get hit at all. By, mm -hmm. like, any, yep. Yeah, that was just a tough, tough situation. It's like... Once Jack got things summoned onto the field, it really limited the amount of options that uh, Peter could really execute yeah. on terms of, like movement and even counterplaying whatsoever. One way or the other, the meter was going to round, the chip was going to start happening, so on and so forth. It was not a checkmate situation truly, but it was sure very difficult from that point. Yeah, onward. against characters like this, that's the health total that Chip wants to play from the absolute least, unless the other character is also on one pixel. Yeah. 
And it's Ooh, really oh, as, oh, oh my god. Okay, okay I was scared. <laughs> I'm just wincing whenever I see it. Um? Oh. Okay. Wow. Oh no, the 6Ps are not landing as much as they were in that first round. Right. It, it, I'm just saying, kind of funny. Oh my god, what? what is happening? I love oh. this. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, a lot of the, you know, just, ironically, despite Peter playing uh, Chip, I feel like Peter is doing a lot of the, like, you know, hold the hold the fort, trying to chase down May, and May's the one who's just kind of fluttering around the screen. Well, case in point, jeez, that sucks. Rolling yeah. rested out here. Good block. Oh, <laughs> oh my, my god. Surprise. All right, the pressure's on again. Oh the my goodness. Here. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, he, he's going to be playing really careful right now. Any hit gets done. If it counter yeah. hits, it's very dangerous. Good crouch. Just not yeah. even crouch blocking, just crouching under that J2H there. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh. Oh, he can't reach the 2P there, unfortunately, oh. but... Oh, good air throw. Oh. Okay. Oh, this what? Is <laughs> oh, no. I'm so wow. mad that he got the overhead kiss from like the opposite end. Like, I don't know if Jack was just that ready or if that was like a missed input, but wow. Yeah, that was good. I that mean, was really good. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> don't know. Don't know what that was for. <laughs> Get this guy off of here! Right. <laughs> ah, <laughs> hey, Jack, there is one solution to that. <laughs> what if you didn't press things? I'm not saying you shouldn't press things. I'm saying you do a great job of it. <laughs> that can be a compliment. People are very good at pressing buttons. <laughs> All right. So after this uh, bracket, we got to have the Jack Walker Ryudo money match. <laughs> I should be able to see Jack Walker. I assume is it this Sunday? Maybe it's next week Sunday. I can't remember. Oh. Alright, it uh, looks like if yeah, if my Nova. eyes doth not deceive me, dear yeah. Macbeth. <laughs> Nova are, versus Padahavi. Uh, yeah, we got full Abba. I feel like I haven't seen Pata Hobby in a while for some reason. Is it just me? Maybe it's just I haven't seen him like on. He's Boston been around. Movie. Okay. But you know, it could just be like, oh, you know, the matches they get us to compensate just happen to kind of like swing around his instead of like being on, you know. Right, right. That makes sense. It is there very there possible. are people that have the curse of like making it pretty far or doing well in these brackets, but like never getting on stream. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's true. We, we, we got our few people that we always got to see. Uh, we always have to start off with like a very like violent match at first. <laughs> that seems to be the consistent uh, amazing thing about Boston Bluebeat. They, yeah, the first I, match I goes nuts. I actually do wonder how they pick it. Yeah. But they used to ask me, and I was like, no, you don't have to do that. Just go with your heart. Mm -hmm. Now I'm like, I don't know what their criteria is since I'm not here. Yeah. <laughs> well, Cliff is, is like not the only violent character in this game. There's like seven, at least. Like, seven is like... Me giving you like the lowest possible number. Right, right. But believe me, it probably actually exceeds that. It might even just be half the roster. It's it's truly just half the roster, but do you would like really like, get the concentrated stuff, like the the been purified through like the waters of Niagara type of stuff. Yeah, it's like it's like maybe down like seven, eight. Seven or eight, yeah. yeah. There are like seven or eight characters who are like the Kefka poisoning the river scene in FF. Yes, exactly. And then like <laughs> The other ten or fifth, like the other ten to fourteen, are like, I don't know, random Sephiroth burning down Nibelheim, and then like <laughs> the, the remaining like four or five are like when Junior Troopa calls you like a jerk in Paper Mario, where it's like this is like offensive maybe if you're like new, but I don't know. I'm yeah, not, yeah. If, if yeah, like, if like when Kai beats me, I don't feel like I just got like like blatantly. Robbed. I'm just like, yeah. yeah, you got me. Yeah, yeah, you have to, you also nod with him and say, yeah, you won. <laughs> but anyone else, I'm like, eh, like, you know, I could have won that if, you know, you didn't go so crazy. If they, I'm blaming on the other person. <laughs> well, you know. All right, speaking of, let's see 
how Nova handles this matchup. <laughs> Imperative to Soul in this matchup is pretty much one thing. Mm -hmm. And it's your favorite thing, because we were talking about it in the last match too. You know, your favorite thing. 6 2 3 H. Uh, yes. Dragon Punch, the Invincible Volcanic Viper, and the mechanic called Instant Block are going right. to help Soul a lot in this matchup. <laughs> because being a character that has an Invincible DP that has a good hitbox and also knocks down means a lot of Abba's big pressure resets can actually be interrupted if he's, if he's looking. Mm -hmm. And a knockdowns against Abba honestly matter more than damage. Yeah, 100%. And I mean, so far, actually, like, this has been like a pure damage round. Tata Abi has not even gotten, like, their first blood bag on or a command grab quite yet either. Nova's oh, moving around very clean. Yep. Ooh. Tata's swinging, but Nova's just not biting. He's like, yeah. yeah, I'm just gonna chill. And that's kind of what you have to do with Soul in this matchup. Mm hmm. I will say one huge perk of that last round, though, is that uh, Tata Abi was able to, uh, you know, step underneath the burst from Nova. So Nova does not have any burst to be able to play around with. So <laughs> Nova yeah. will die if Tata Abi gets going. Yeah, there it is. Low profile. Oh, okay. There we go. One third. The other thing is that Soul has, like, command grabs and throws. Mm. And Wild Throw, very helpfully, knocks down and locks you out of burst. Yes. <gasps> oh. oh. I just traded my copy of Metal Gear Solid 1 for a bootleg Pokemon game. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Woo! And let's go. All right, kept about the poison water right now here. Let's yeah. see. Yeah, oh, no, no. Oh, no. Ran out of juice at the very end there. Couldn't land in time before the 5K came out. Celeste just stabbed him right there. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty close. <laughs> Pretty Thanks, close, Celeste. yeah. You, you see Abba on one pixel in Goku Mora, huh? And, like, if you hadn't been commentating this game for a while, you're, you kind of knew. You're like, oh, man. She's really got to run uphill, and everybody else is like, it's just one JH away from a disaster, yeah. right? Like, <laughs> this is one correct button away from uh, taking the entire match. <laughs> so spooky. Oh, nice. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, oh, I saw the attempts coming out there. Looking like level 99 survival. Oh, what a DP. <laughs> oh, but misses the safe oh. jump as well, and misses the burst again as well, too. powderhoffy has been great at baiting those out. Oh, no legs. Yes. So They're gone. Don't legs. have them. Oop. Okay. Oh, he was out of range. I don't think he was yeah. ready for that to whiff. Yeah, I was, I was like, oh, yeah, you can punish that possibly, but uh, no, Nova wasn't ready, which is fair. The correct answer is, if you're not sure, don't mess around. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Hada has to burst or take this yeah. down. Yep. Using that oh. to heal. Oh, gonna get oh, oh! No! Can't reach him. Fortunately for a pot of hobby here, so that's Oh my god, the guard bar! The guard bar! The guard oh bar. no, Pata! No! Oh, no! Oh my gosh, and this smash is like K at the end there. Might as well use your fastest option, probably maybe throw resting it as well. What the hell? It's just three frames. Yeah. <laughs> what can happen in three frames? Yeah. <laughs> a whole lifetime of anguish. <laughs> yeah, you know, honestly. Oh, nice combo. Yeah, oh. so this is where you actually, as Soul, get to, to go for the hard stuff. Because you don't mind if you reset normal mode at it. Right. Against Moraha, though, you're like, nah, no hard combos. Just no, gonna... just sit down. Ooh. Speaking of, here it is. Oh, all right. see if Nova has that resilience in him. Ooh, well, it's not a great start here so yep. far here. Because no, Hadahabi has no burst on their side, and Nova's really straight strong here with a super to finish it off, maybe. Oh, oh the kill! That, that was the sick. The last two hits, I wasn't even sure. Standing ovation. That was amazing, actually. Great confirms there in that last round from both uh, going from corner to corner and then going for the double, uh, I guess the double meter spin, I would call it. <laughs> yeah, cashing out. Cashing out. That was a, that was incredible. Good stuff. Good showing there from Nova. Really keeping against Padahabi. Yeah, I really like that at the end, too, because ABBA... Despite having a really high, like, the really good defense modifier, she's very tanky, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, her guts is actually zero. So right. all those, like, hits like that, while she still has a little bit of a, of a boost when she's low on health, like, because even at gut zero, you get a little bit of a hand. Mm -hmm. um, it's not as much. And Nova's like, heck yeah, I can, like, spend all this meter and really cash out with the clean hit bonus and take it to town. Really good awareness. I really yeah. like that. All right. Well, people... Complained about it before, because I, I was clearly complaining uh, about no cliff. But now, yeah, where are you? Yeah. Here. So we yeah. got Izzy. I, I'm really interested to see how Izzy handles this matchup after. Oh, there we go. Nice round start. Yeah, I guess that's how oh, you handle it. Fuzzy. Ooh, may wait for a bit there for a burst, or maybe oh, just drop the combo. Oh, oh my god. 
Oh, the little F-chickies. They're coming out. Oh, yep. Yeah. That's yeah. it. That's the round. Yep. And this goes to something we saw a little bit, or we talked about a little bit <laughs> earlier of, you know, not changing your game plan if it's just working. We saw that from Izzy there, going for the fuzzy twice in a row, going for the overhead. There's a lot of nod checking here from Izzy, I feel like, that is working out very, very well. Yeah, exactly. That's Milia, you can challenge that by using things like roll. Mm -hmm. Nice IB. Nice jump IB. Can't quite punish. That's okay, though. Yeah, Milia, without pin here. Oh, that might be a stun. Oh, yeah, oh no! There. Oh my gosh! Okay, oh no, can't confirm on that as well. It, it might not matter at this point here. Good throw there from Burrito, yeah. just keep making it a wrap. That's how this matchup tends to go. Just very one-sided, oh, one way or the other. Oh, great blocking the pin there. Ooh, nice oh. nade. Oh, oh no! Can reach his time with the throw. pin as well. So we're gonna go to the corner here. Let's see if he can get the defense back on again. Yep, there we go. Just meaties the end of the spot dodge there. The gold burst does not quite connect. It's the taunt. Oh, oh my goodness. That's cranking the stun. That last letter, though, messed it up. Mm hmm. Burrito just trying to fill it out. Get one more hit. Get started. Yeah, you had to burst there. That pin is very, very, very solidly in the corner, and Izzy is not allowing it to move at all. Oh! Yep, nice 2D! Very good stuff, You should always man. be planning for that as Cliff. In this matchup, your goal? Predominantly, above all else, beyond even running pressure, because Milia's anti-airs are very strong against Cliff, but beyond running pressure, you're really looking for the moment she's going to be holding up. Because yes. you want to catch her low, or you want to chase her jump from the ground creatively. And mm -hmm. Izzy did that really well at the end there. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool game. Appreciate Creatively. you. <laughs> Creatively. Oh, nice tech. Oh my God, the charge that was charged. Murder. Oh. Oh my God. Oh, okay. Oh no, the five K whiffing. Millie is kind of light. Got bounced up a little high, but okay. Oh, here we go. Big combo. Tries to jump. Maybe trying to slash back the Secret Garden orb, which I do sometimes too. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, and then, you know, it takes a little bit of bravery at that point. Oh, nice confirm! Like, oh my that's gosh! <laughs> now, despite how hard that might look, that's like the easiest, one of the easiest confirms Cliff has. <laughs> like, not that it's really? easy, but like, okay. it, it, when you're learning, it's one of the ones I recommend first, because it's just very good and very reactable. Oh, catches the dodge too, so that's going to be some, some great stun. Right, Burrito should be looking. Here. Nice burst. They want to answer or get a nice counter hit. Oh, the letters. Oh, the oh <laughs> reached out that. too far and touched the letters. That's so unfortunate there. Gonna shout from the backside. Oh, what's the big pressure reset? Nice roll. Ooh, great back, jump back JD as well. This is clean. Oh, but we get a second one, unfortunately. Nice block on CKBM. No close slash, though. We're gonna see their fuzzy. Oh no! Actually tricks it up with a 2k. Oh no throw! Too early on the button. Oh no. Oh, yep. Just set her down. <laughs> Let her take One a One thing, yeah. As against Cliff, you gotta be careful with where you put in the disc. Uh he can just crouch under it. Even at lowest possible height. Mm-hmm. And so it could get really dangerous for Amelia to start doing stuff like air FB disc unless she's really, really, really eyeballing the timing properly on when Cliff is trying to move at her. Because he'll just kind of exist under it in a lot of circumstances. And just mm. dialing in that throw there to catch the landing was pretty much the perfect play for Mizzy. Yeah, yeah. Just sometimes you gotta chillax. Just uh, stay under, you know. If you if you have all this pressure on your shoulders, just put your shoulders lower. Relax. Yeah, exactly. Just loosen up, right? Exactly. Mm. All right. Let's see. Let's see what the boss man... Has set up for us today. Oh, ho, 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 ho. X Phantom versus Rumper. Ooh, this is gonna be a good one for sure. So X Phantom, as people definitely know, uh, pretty pretty good in the uh, Guilty Gear Plus R scene. Has been uh, doing like top three or better at every tournament they've been able to attend in the last few months, in person, online, so on and so forth. Usually around the uh, second and first place section. 
but uh, going against Rumble here, jam. And X Phantom, as we saw at uh, CO Talk, or CO Talk, excuse me, TNS, uh, playing against Giga, uh, that's a local player as well. So yeah, X he's got a lot all... of practice in this yeah. matchup. <laughs> I mean, yeah, X Phantom, just really, really strong player by feel, and this is a really good tempo. And that's mm -hmm. really what's going to carry carry him really far in this matchup. Right. See what Rumper can do to maybe disrupt that tempo. Though. Nice Ooh. parry. Well, that's a good way to do it. That's a good start. Yeah, parry is incredibly good as Jam in this matchup. Mm -hmm. You know, Haas has a lot of pressure resets with mids. And uh, mids are highs, rather. And <laughs> parry will cover both. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, all right, this is the corner here. You're off to go for a bigger charge. Oh, what a, whoa. That JH is God. You know, yeah, that that's a constant in life, isn't it? All right, yeah. card, pot of greed. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> I like that. Oh my god. Okay. Oh yep. He's there. It's hot. Another one. All right. Will Ryujin have? Oh no, close. There, there we go. We're gonna push into the corner here. Get as much damage as possible. Card up. More cards. Oh, oh save jumps the DP, but oh no, the punish. And catches the back dash as well! And even charges from another rock at the end, just for good measure. You gotta make sure, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's only one way to be sure. Yeah, keep rain. Even on IB, kind of tough to punish you that range for Hoss. Nice pickup! I don't know why, but when it, whenever Jam gets hit in the air, she turns into the Tetris L block. Yeah! <laughs> and you unlock like 30 million new combos you didn't know you could hit. Right. <laughs> and all, all the on OTG! Oh my gosh, turn that OTG off! Trying to sleep. Oh, you gotta spend 50 meters for that. But hey, it's pretty cool. Oh! Yeah. Nice block! Oh. Oh, great FS but, though. Yeah, that was really good. Preventing uh, x from killing what? any further. Oh, it uses the X there. FB there. Oh, that's unfortunate. Can't really hit anything out of the air. Just like. Kill him. Wow, x is just dashing up and just hitting like these very stubby buttons, making sure that anything that Rumper oh. wants to do, their oh, approach is big damage stuff. though. Oh my god! Actually, shock oh, stun it. Ooh, maybe one more could do it. No, too many hits. Too many oh hits. my gosh, yeah. But actually, gets a knockdown here. Oh, nice tries block. To mix it up. Oh, the beat on the dead angle. That was clean and double wow. to the confirm. Rumper. Just the rumper. He played that so well. He was down almost that entire round. That was really clean. Yeah, I'm in, I'm legit impressed. That was amazing. The heck are you? Give RoboCop oh. players jam and they just turn into like Minecraft creative mode. What the right. heck? <laughs> oh, nice jump mode. out! Yeah, That's gonna be there. really costly too. That Fafnir whiffing is gonna kill the meter game for a bit. Mm hmm. Another 5 though. Really great from Rumper as well for the anti air. It's done, doing a great job kind of controlling some of that like air to ground neutral from X Phantom. And confirming as well here. Alright. He's really gonna be looking for burst here. If he gets that hit on Phantom. Mm hmm. What a JK? What the heck? That I was a that Robo was a Kai player, JK. Yeah, yeah that was actually. Just I've Gossip never seen it like basic. that. <laughs> you know, yeah, in this game, you've either got a JK that does that or a JK that does everything in that. Mm -hmm. oh, oh my god. The it's gonna hurt. Level. Can we get. Oh, I don't Ooh. know if we're gonna be able to guts crush here. It's gonna be a little tricky. Uh, I think at least they just want the hit. knockdown minimum, so that's actually pretty yeah, good there. Ah, oh, the JS! This is a match. That was the first. That was the first match. Yeah, that was two. really close. That was really well played by Rumper. Like they're doing stuff that you like see after like the whole set has happened. Type of stuff. No, that was that was first blush between these two in this tournament set. Like you said, Giga is local, but what I really appreciate about Rumper and every other Jam player, like cut from this cloth, they're really creative. Mm hmm. Oh. Nice six P. Yeah. All right. All right, buddy. All right. I see you! I see you pressing 60! Mm-hmm. Stop it! Stop it! Yeah. I think it's kind of like maybe adding to the mental stack a little bit. Just saying, I'm going to throw out a few different options here. You're going to have to pay attention to them. You know, it's one of those kind of pressing buttons that feels empty, but it means that, oh, that's actually something that's on the table and they can confirm off of. Yeah, it is one of those things where it's like, it's that. But also, it would be pretty funny if they counter it, you know? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and you would feel very silly. because like, I saw him do it three times. Why, why did I get hit by it? Ooh. Oh, <laughs> okay, sure. Yeah. 
And they say this game has cross-up protection. I think they lied. Yeah. <laughs> As in, you're protected from blocking the cross-up. That's, that's what they were talking about. Nice carry. Oh my god. It's like, a, I guess carry DP would have been the only choice. Mm -hmm. What an Ooh. FS. Yeah, these four slashes are doing work right now for a rumper. Holy crap. Wow. Ooh. Gosh golly, that was a really nice flash kick. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the FRC! Once again. Oh, and blocks oh, down. Yeah, just going to use an escape plan. <gasps> oh, oh and gets a my god. Oh, no. Freestyle. Let's go. Got to get confirm off the corner here. We've been seeing it from Rumper this entire time. So if Rumper gets this uh, gets this situation, if you keep the momentum, that is an immensely favorable outcome. Oh, mm -hmm. but what a pickup. I don't care if it's a black beat. It's a real combo. Yeah, it's a real combo to me, damn it. Oh, oh, nice oh that's it. Slash again. If you get that's the it. From this that's Rumper drops. I'm sorry. Oh. I'm sorry. Oh. <laughs> Why'd I say anything? Oh. <laughs> Why'd I say anything? All right, everyone oh. boo T5. Everybody kill me. Everybody kill me with <laughs> everyone hammers kill right T5. now. <laughs> Everybody kill me with hammers immediately. That was a great set. Exploding hammers in your exploding car. Well, it was a good set, and then T5 had to say something. Oh. <laughs> but no, seriously, between that was an insanely great set, like... They were adapting to each other very, very well. They were putting their buttons out in the field in like the most immaculate ways to prevent each other from moving in and just really getting their game plan going super easily. And they were kind of playing on like four to five different levels of like approachability and anti-approachability. Listen, <laughs> I, I haven't done that on commentary in so long. When's the last time you commentated? I have, to, I have to make sure that my that the commentator's curse, like, like fact of life, is still real. You know. So when's the last time you commentated? <laughs> just just as he went so long ago, it looked like that's all. I'm trying to remember, I don't know. <laughs> like two weeks ago? It's not like that long. Come on. You acted like I haven't been here for like 10 years. <laughs> All right, here we go. Milia Soul. So normally, uh, when it comes to contesting Milia air buttons, your best choice is not to. But Soul is one of those few characters that actually can. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna yep. see if uh, Nova can really put that together. Oh, he pressed JH. He's figured it out. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Yep. Problem solved. That button uh, does a lot of heavy lifting. But really, yeah, it's just like the retirement home meal supplement it in this matchup. <laughs> it, is, it is that good. Oh, nice cross up. Or maybe it wasn't a cross up. I don't know. Check the tapes later. That one wasn't. It was same side. He just went back over. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. Reverses the corner here. Gets the full confirm as well. Oh, right, jump back. Fade away jumper. That was sick. Can it work? <gasps> no, we're not playing reload. It's okay, though. All right. <laughs> Sorry, got the grab on the ground here. Very good. JH again. Oh, he's okay, he cancel. No burst. Nice pick up. Come on, Def. Just a couple hits. Yeah. Yeah, good stuff there from Def. Still, right, you know, playing around Nova's ability to, like, you go, do uh, grand, uh, almost grand Viper. God. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to call it Grandpa Viper because I'm feeling old right now. But yeah. <laughs> Just getting above the situation very, very well, honestly. Nice movement from Nova. Ooh! Ooh! That's oh, big. That's yeah. gonna hurt. Yeah! Nice 6P there to catch the tech. Yeah, he, he did FD for just like one second, but he let it go. Oh my goodness. I love GH. <laughs> it is a move of all time. Comedy button. Uh, DP again from Nova here. We, we saw some pretty good DP, DPs from Nova in the last match against uh, Prada Javi and everything. And it is working just as well here. Overhead. Oh, was that OTG? Oh, what? that was so. like the best response. And I, nice oh, no, no 6P here. for you. No punish, though. Oh my god. Yeah, just oh, wait for the throw. throw. That was clean. Good nice patience. Pin. Oh, can you kill? No. If you have to FD, though. Yeah, but kind of burn through all that FD meter as much as possible. That nice was good. There. Great block. Yeah. 
aware that they wanted to grab the pin and go for more pressure. They were able to get <gasps> a nice 2D. Oh, and oh my yeah. gosh, that was on the that was on the baby toe on that 6K. I was close. Very, very, very close. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I think if he had caught the landing recovery on that JD after he went under it. Yeah, the 5K, I don't know what happened. If it looked like he was about to catch that, that would have been it. It would have mm -hmm. been a confirm. Nice JP. That's the other button. Yeah, <laughs> JP also really good for a custom air to air situation. Jumping punch, yeah, Ooh. pretty good. Pretty okay, okay. normal. It, it, it does, it, it, it functions, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, over the pin! Wow! JH once again doing it for all the people out there. You know, I can't lose after that. Not after that beautiful JH. <laughs> oh! Threat stamp air IB, which is a really weird situation. Mm -hmm. That should be it. Yeah. That was still good stuff there. Keep into the corner very, very strongly. Oh, oh my god, tries to slash back. Doesn't quite get it. Doesn't die though, so it's okay. Yeah, that's what a 5k. For Big 2D! Yup! Oh, the change! <laughs> no! Oh, time to go for the air throw there. Doesn't work out. And oh, actually reverses and does the oh pick no, with the second air dash. Oh, not quite enough hits done there. Oi. Ooh, great KD. Oh, it's just big. Yeah, can punch that. starter. Nice dead angle. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, my goodness. That's huge. Nice good dead yep. angle. That's unfortunate. Beautiful. Beautiful from Nova. I like that. That was a really back and forth round. I like that. Mm -hmm. All right. Death still on set point here. Oh, you know what thing? I like Death actually using a lot of the, the air dashes to kind of like right, delay some of the big. timing on pin, and that has been working out super, super well for them. No burst still. This might be the spot. Oh my oh god! Oh my god! Okay, we jumper once again. And we get the knockdown. Yep, I like the first time we saw it. Now we're gonna do it again. Looking for burst. Air oh throw. my gosh. Nice. Oh my <laughs> god. Oh <laughs> no way. This sucks. Going over the dead angle there and just punishing with a. <laughs> at the end, that was super good. Oh, but a super oh, nice mix up with that force break. Disc. Oh my god. We almost watched maybe the. That was almost. The funniest shit I've ever seen. I, no, you know what? No, it wasn't almost. That was. It, it was. What the heck happened? <laughs> you know, I, I think to myself every day when you slash back a move, surely it should be the most favorable position. But, like, in that case, if you just jump IB and thrown, <laughs> you would have landed on the same side. <laughs> I'm just saying. It was a good flashback, though. Ooh, yeah. But, you know. I, I was impressed. It was. <laughs> they landed it. Shock turns to horror when <laughs> when he just flies over your head and you're close slash and he doesn't hit him. Oh. Uh, very well played to both players. That was great. Yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. He's taking a look at our stuff here, but also, while we're waiting... Well, we have a little bit of a downtime here. If you haven't clicked on that match Reno yet, definitely do as such. The folks out here and the games out here have been absolutely going buck wild for you all. And uh, it would be very respectful if you made sure that we use yet yeah, use one of our 100 codes for tonight. We have a lot to get through. And you all are actually doing a pretty decent number on these, actually. So keep up the good work. Yeah, we got double codes. I mean, you should click them twice as much. You can get twice. Yeah, you can get twice. You can hit the button twice and get the dopamine twice. Does it mean you can click them twice, or does it mean we get like double the amount? Because whenever like, I've seen, I've ever seen double codes, I've been confused, and I feel like the last time we had double, whenever I clicked it once, it counted as two. But I don't, I don't know if that's true. I mean, I can. I well, I clicked both of them. I had yeah, two I'm gonna, I'm gonna claim codes, again. and I clicked both I'm of them. See if I can click it. See and that. not everyone did, because one of them has 25 remaining, the other one has 30 remaining. <laughs> so people apparently clicked it once and called it a day. Wait, this is week six. Isn't this week seven today? No, no, this is week six. There was the they accidentally posted an incorrect one. Is, is today? Well, is this is this the one? No. 
I have to, to just... find the right one, yeah. I'll just at you. There you go. Unfortunately, the night bot is cruel. You got it this time? You doing yeah, it? Yeah, I do. I got it. You and many other folks who are doing it at home, I'm sure. Once again, thank you all so much for uh, cooking on that match, Reno. Greatly appreciate it. With these double coast tonight, people are coming in really strong after a TNS this past weekend. So let's let's give some love for the folks out there who are uh, working their ass off despite saying, "Oh yeah, I got done the tournament." Anyways, time to play some more. All right. So next up, we're gonna have X Phantom versus Soup. And this, this is one of those matches I feel like you can just go, like, one way or the other. Oh, Either yeah. Super is able to keep x Phantom out, and or x Phantom is just on I think these two them. players just interact in a way that, you know, it just facilitates it. And they run into each other, like, every bracket, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It feels like whenever these two are in the same tournament, this is just going to happen. Yeah. No matter how far in it is. It's not a matter of, like... Bracket like length. It's just like destiny. It's like God's plan. Oh, yeah. wait, 2 H. Oh God. Oh, and a counter hit J H as well. Here we're gonna just max my guard bar. Actually, that didn't do as much as I thought it would. Mm -hmm. Taking the time to set up. What an FRC on the DI spike, which is a different timing, by the way. I should know. Oh, here we go. All right. The next man is very good defending. Planet patient approaching very very cleanly here. Yeah, I love that use of JP to go over the fish and pop it at the same time. That's a... Mm -hmm. Talked about soul JP. This is like super soul JP. Super know? soul? <laughs> oh! Right, can't finish Cannot there, get the max amount of hits. Nice block. Oh, I'm mashing! Oh my gosh. I'm trying to slash back in as well. <laughs> Disrespect to the fish and got the ice spike in return. Yeah, there we go. <gasps> Yeah, nice instant block to the JP there, making sure that Soup can't jump up and try to go for a throw or anything. Jumping punch. Do not underestimate the power. Have a good old the reward point. might not be incredible. But, oh my god, that was so smart! Wow, the that was super good, and oh no, it hits OTG, so x is able to tech forward and keep the pressure on the Soup. Is he bursting? No, he's not. Sorry, he wants to try to beat it out now as much as possible. Misses the slash back, unfortunately. He wanted to throw. It's a little too fast on the input. Good block. Oh, what a whiff punish. Ooh, yeah. Just stopping very short there to get that far slash. Oh, no FRC. That's big. It's my turn now. This could be massive for X-Venom. Mm -hmm. Close it out. Oh, and gets a super out this time as well. Got caught in the Oh, that's going to... Ew, oh no! Just the way that, that DP connects as an ender just seems really, really... Awkward? Really, really unfavorable. Yeah. But Major trying to get as much damage out as possible here. Didn't work out, unfortunately. Nice JP there. Oh, jumps he jumps! Out, yep. And it just rockets right back in. Very clean. Yeah, those air DP enders... <laughs> normally it hits at least like a couple times, like two or three, but I guess Dizzy just kind of flies out. You only get that one hit, so when you're trying to squeeze out that last little bit of health in those air hit situations, it can be really tough. Mm hmm Yeah, I assume that might just have to be, like, the weight, the lightness, and just sitting kind of, like, very high up in the air. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, that's big damage. Oh, oh my, my God. Oh, my God. Ow. Hey, that I didn't have any guard bar. Yeah, I hey, love it when X-Phantom actually hitting 2 peed and then jumping out immediately to get over the spike. So it forced Suit to just kind of have to watch for a little bit. Ooh, oh dear. But, all right. So, Phantom does have a little bit of a hill to climb here. Mm -hmm. And he really wants to avoid getting in here like that again. Yeah. So it's like 100% the number one priority because of, well, oh. I oh. went and said it. Yeah, I feel like every did. time this is happening, it's it's just, I'm, ugh. Oh. I, I, I see why just, they haven't called you back in two weeks. I'm yeah, just they, yeah they, they, they're firing me. I'm just getting all their best players killed. Yeah, yeah. Could you stop? I'm like incidentally wonder of you. Like, I don't know why that's happening. 
Oh my gosh, just sailing with the JPs there to push Soup into the corner. And nice. another JP chase down. Nickel and oh diming, but it's working out. Yeah, X Men. Who be said going five to the cents bank. wasn't worth a lot in this economy? Right, Look at right. That. Even our codes are worth twenty-five cents. We're worth five times the value. Oh, that was so good. <gasps> oh no, this <laughs> sucks so much. <laughs> you know, honestly. Oh, that was sick. The extension with the laser. Oh yeah, oh, you had to oh, there. Yeah, I yep. don't want to be there. <laughs> you just do not want to be in that situation. Gosh, X Phantom just really able to keep it down despite like the pressure from Soup and everything. It's just I'm I'm impressed how he's able to keep his like mental together and like keep his gameplay so strong despite <laughs> despite everything, despite stuff like that happening. That's been around since Slash, baby. Yeah. Oh my God, Slash what a count! Is. Oh, but oh, we got a little greedy with that. I think he could have just gone for the knockdown. Oh no! Nice two S though. Yeah, great confirm here. Uh, oh, that might have been an OSJH looking for burst there. Soup bursting a little later. Mm -hmm. Thank goodness. Oh, on here. Doesn't got to oh. cancel anything. <laughs> wow, the chase on the level two. <laughs> it's huge. Let's go, Rocket. Oh, but. Soup's doing a great job here with the pressure. Gets back into the corner once again. Oh. No, I don't know, like. How, how I can explain this, other than just he has just been correct on every block here. Right? But again, that's what happens when you play with somebody for such a long time. Mm-hmm. It seems to be like, like you know, do seems to be a lot of great things here. Trying to go for frame traps, trying to set things up very well. I would say the best thing that seems kind of gotten away nice with is like, reacting very well to, like, you know, the charges, but... That's it, yep. God. x Phantom is just leaving no ground between the two of them. And I'll move X-Phantom up to uh, the winner's finals, and we'll be facing off against the winner between Deft and Izzy, the Oklahomies, back at it again. Yeah, you know, you gotta have it. This is just like the only two plus R players in Oklahoma, or so they say. I don't know. So if they claim, yeah. <laughs> but, like, no one else is there to like, counteract it whatsoever, so we just have to assume that they're correct. Why would they go on the internet and lie? And then we'll come on the loser side as well for we have a future matches here. So we'll have like Jack Wachter versus Rumper, which that'll oh. be really good. I, and... uh, I'm excited to see how Rumper handles that. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Uh, so Burrito wins out against Peter on one end. So Burrito will be waiting for the winner between uh, Nova and Mr. Pomegranix. <laughs> oh, no. And Mr. Pomegranix already killed another soul. Gonte. What in the heck? Nobody else. No one. <laughs> Oklahoma, more like no Oklahoma. Yeah, the Oklahoma team kill just seems to keep happening. But yeah. these, these two players are both pretty common choices as far as people who will make it far in bracket, you know. Mm -hmm. they've, they've consistently done it. They've shown their strength, and they're keeping it up week over week, honestly. It's legitimately impressive when you can get a smaller community together and just be like, cool, we're going to be holding it down for like the entirety of our state. You know, no one's going to notice us either. <laughs> Unfortunately, Deft is moving out at some point, I believe. Oh, no. So oh, it, at no. some point, it's really going to just be Izzy. But for now, she can enjoy the company, you know. You're, you're going to have to take Izzy with you, actually, Deft. You know, I don't think she'd protest. <laughs> I don't know if she wants to be in Oklahoma. It's like a prison, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> Allegedly. I've only been to Oklahoma once. I don't know. And not by choice. From what she tells me, she's, she's not a fan, but you know. I... <laughs> All right. So now I'm we have it back again here. Deft versus Izzy. So we get to see this matchup again. I'm interested to see Izzy playing into Deft. Mm -hmm. She's going to have to really slow it down and make those big hits count. Oh, big trade. Oh, oh. oh that's a good trade. Yep, backdash. Alright, try to use a drill there to try to prevent the movement. Oh, that's a big death. 2D. No 2S though. Mm-mm. Actually, -mm. being a little bit drill happy here, you know. And Death's actually staying up in the air, probably just to avoid that as much as possible. Yeah, you don't want to be in the corner as nearly in this match. 
Oh my gosh. Oh, no burst on the easy side as well. This is going to get very, very difficult from this point. <laughs> that was yep. the kind of mix-up that you played this person for so long that you just doing the same stuff over and over might catch them off guard. Yeah, because they're, they're like looking. Yeah, they're like, you're going to do something, you're going to do something, you're going to do something. They're like, no, 2K, 2K, 2K. the landing, <laughs> drops. It's been unfortunate. Oh, we're swinging. Ooh, all right, nice JD there. Wall bounces again. <gasps> oh, what a good chase down, but can't get the full confirm, unfortunately. <gasps> oh my god, yeah. Use my <laughs> nice dives there. Is it just kind of throwing new stuff? I feel like probably at death mage to kind of like maybe slow the pace down just a little bit to make them think of a little, a little more, but ooh, it's getting rough. All right, so death mage taking the first one against Izzy here, and it feels like just like with Izzy's options as and what's being cycled through right now, uh, seems to be a little bit. Finding the right answer, I guess, the best way to put yeah, it. Yeah, that it's it's really tricky. Mm-hmm. The key is Cliff is to be on the ground and press QD a lot in the right spots in yeah. this matchup. And then at, at, at its like absolute core. Nice FS, but no confirm. Oh, catches the 6P on startup. Oh, there we go. Alright, got some lockdown here. Jump to nice the Nice pickup! So Yo, yes! You really take out midair. At least that they got the conversion. So the damage is heavily on Izzy's side now. Nice. I like that JK whiffing, but JS to catch the roll. Ooh. And now, oh, 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 what a good throw as well. Can maximize damage here. Who actually says a burst? I wouldn't call it a true hero burst, but it's it's on the edge of it. That's for sure. Alright, so go for the gunshot. Actually, punishes it there well with the JD. Might be able to get the full confirm here. Is he not popped in the burst potentially? Yeah. Doesn't look like it. I thought Izzy would super after that 2S. Yeah! When your opponent's so close. <gasps> Alright, guess I'm back him on here. Alright, fuzzy jumps. Death blocks it. And that's 5D. That was a, that was oh, a really good fight. Oh, oh no, the, the new so route. <laughs> is he just want to make you proud, T5? This is still your fault. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Nice pickup. <laughs> I, the new route is not the easiest, but I, I, I fuck with it. You're going to have to practice it sometimes, so you might as well do it when the pressures are yeah, high. Yeah, yeah. It does work. Low. You have to FD jump late and get the JH right. Mm -hmm. Nice block. I don't know if Deft is ready for that to hit like that. It is pretty nice feel like it, you know. Alright. Corner here once again. So wait, that oh my god! The El Cabong comes out here. No! That's an unfortunate situation. Still, one reverse on Izzy's side here, so it was one more opportunity to escape danger, and that's the best way to escape with a gold burst. Ooh, yeah. Oh. Uh, uh. Not hitting any buttons. Yeah. No, yeah. 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 That was that was a tough one. <laughs> Your buttons are slightly a little bit slower than the the fly on the wall, <laughs> Amelia. What can you really do all the time? Still good stuff there from uh, Def. Moving on to winners finals against X Phantom. Uh, is he still playing very very well though? Looking for some, maybe some new stuff to play around with and really bring it to the next matches. We're seeing the growth mid-tournament set, and that's absolutely fine. So that would bring us... I think this officially puts us into... I guess actually top six, huh? <laughs> yeah, we're pretty fast. God, yeah. <laughs> there's been a lot of violent matches tonight, I guess, maybe. It's true. I, I don't think there's been one that hasn't been. That's right. something that uh, I'm not used to. Usually we have some, like, we have some like, cool-down matches, but this no. time it's just been, like, yeah, yeah. It's just, just high-octane the whole time. Yeah, yeah. Post-TNS has really brought out the strength in people, 
And uh, I don't know, maybe just some excitement to say, cool, we're going to be able to play more offline again. We're starting to see these tournaments, like new tournaments come up uh, around the U.S. and everything. So that's uh, that's great, honestly. And I mean, if you're looking for more offline matches as well, we, you know, Boston Blue Week will still have their offline monthlies. Uh, the next one being on March 16th with all the regular tiles that you see during the weeklies, the, the BBCF, Strive, Exard, Sailor Moon, and so on and so forth. And so if you go to Balance Patch, they'll be handling the signups at uh, 4 p.m. With, or the earliest back will be at 4 p.m., but it'll be opening at 2 p.m. So definitely check them out. Sponsored by Junk Food Arcades. Always keep it down for the cool controllers. Definitely check out the Snackbox Micros. All right, so back at it again here. We will have Rumper versus Jack Oh, Walker. baby. All right. So I don't know who's going to get stunned first, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> these, these characters both have above the bar stun resistance. May have got a little bit more. Mm -hmm. And they both do a ton of stun damage. So it might kind of even out into just a, a kind of standard big damage, big hit snatcher. Right, right. So it's whoever can kind of get Ooh, what a off. 6P on that. Oh, oh but. And I will say both. Yeah, both of these players are very, very good at, like, like using, like, optimal buttons in this, like, situation to steal the turn back. So they, they have a lot of bravery in that regard. Case in point, I would have oh never carried goodness. that. I, I would have never tried. <laughs> Just to show Rupert could. Oh, my gosh. JD, JD. Yes. Okay, yes, excuse me. No, it's all good. <laughs> Jam kind of just spins around in the air for like half her air buttons. It's... Yeah. <laughs> Guess the spin, idiot. Oh my gosh, again. Brawl Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> oh! Oh, the 3k under the bubble! Oh, here we go. Overhead kiss connects. Yeah, make this count here. No burst on the rumper side. Or, excuse me, no rumper side. I looked at it wrong. <gasps> oh. <gasps> oh my gosh. My medias aren't hitting. Steam Jesus. support? Oh. All right, oh! Dolphin again to get a knockdown here. Oh, that's good for a 6P opener, but gets thrown for their troubles. And oh once again, JS. JS. Oh, I'm no pressing JS. Help, help. I'm pressing. Okay. <laughs> you know, in this situation, if there was one move I could see Rumper building an entire round out of, it would be that one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm anticipating there'll be at least one more. Oh, nice. Ooh. Oh, go first. Oh, I'm this is a full bit, yeah. Four FP Ooh. pump balls. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the, huh? the softest and hard knockdown. <laughs> yeah. All right. Once again, make this damage count as much as possible. Get the uh, corner off of this. Oh, but unfortunately, gets he suspected on the wake up. <gasps> oh, my leg. On the toes. All right. All right what's the punish? Wow. Yeah. Gem 2D lightning fast button. Mm -hmm. Dial it in. Gosh, yeah. Lightning fast button, six frames. Just reaches from so far away and just go straight into the combo. Just go straight for it. Might as well. All right, so I think there's kind of a hard spot for uh, Jack a little bit because Jack has, you know, usually kind of goes to the air as like a way, because that's a maze strength, being able to yeah. be in the air. Uh, but Rumper is really being brave and hitting a lot of JS to make sure that Jack can't just get down for free, and Jack is eating a lot of damage from that. Yeah, it's residual, but it's adding up really fast. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh my no. god. That, I can't believe it. Oh, yep, there it is. Yeah, same, actually. Oh! It oh hit fast god. enough! Oh my goodness. All right, go for the walkway here. No, you're not. Nope, yep. Wow. J -H. It's the thing. <laughs> that when Jack's golden space, as far as air approaches goes, is the one that Rumper is really comfortable just pressing JS in. Mm-hmm. And that's just a really hard part. It's like, well, now if you can't go into the air anymore all that well, what, what comes next? How do you up your ground game, if possible? Oh! Oh my god! Well, that's a great way of starting it out here. <gasps> Oh my god. Oh, oh, please. Oh, that one against the up dolphin at that point of the more movement? Jeez, I did not reach, realize that reached that low. Oh, whoop. <laughs> okay. Uh, goodbye. <gasps> what a good air throw. And what a good World, ground throw. World's most normal connect. Oh, wait. We actually might see a stun here. Yeah, if we get the last little hit here. Jumping and defending, though. Rumper is staying alive. <gasps> oh, he's. Oh. Right, that's dead. 
Yeah, but Donald Burst is going to come back be. here. Yeah, that I'm was like a gonna hit I'm not going to say it. <laughs> I'm not going to say it unless it's just dead. He's done. All right. All right. You you, you reserved yourself. I have I uncursed understand. bumper. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say the words. Yep. We are completely fine. <laughs> You're out here doing doing the work. I, I'm so proud of yeah, you. Yeah, you know, it's the hard. I'm really proud to accept this uh, Emmy nomination. <laughs> <laughs> Play the role of the, the the quiet man. Oh my god! Can you imagine? <laughs> yes. The, the, can, like, how contrived of a story would that be? Yeah, you know, I wasn't even like watching any of the plus R brackets or hearing them. I was just saying things and hoping that Ryuto wasn't talking while I was saying anything. You know? <laughs> And then I can just put it all together on the hype reel later on. <laughs> exactly. Oh, hey. God. So with that, Rumble will move on against Izzy in the Losers quarterfinals. And then we're going to be moving on to Burrito versus Nova, who is able to take down Mr. Pomegranix 2-1. So the last soul standing. A very soulful, soulful final bracket, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, it's pretty funny. We got two souls and Hoss in top eight. Almost. If if nobody can make it through, yes. Or maybe one soul in in Hoss, I believe. Yeah, I was gonna say like uh, I don't know how you're numbering your souls here, but yeah, you know. I might be exposing myself as the quiet man. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'm like you know, the I'm... quiet man if he was like mathematically screwed. <laughs> the like... math man, <laughs> the arithmetic man. I I would not play that. It's just number muncher. I mean, they made a game like that. Called Donkey Kong Junior Math. If you're interested, oh, that's true. It has that's two true. player. You can you can like do competitive math. If if you've ever thought, you ever thought they, you thought they only did that as like a side bracket at like chess tournaments? No. <laughs> can you imagine like going to like a, a suite at like Evo and then you walk into the room and there's like, hey, twenty dollar Donkey Kong Junior uh, Math money match. But everyone's bad, so they don't know how much twenty dollars actually is because no one can do the math. I feel like it'd be a little bit ironic. <laughs> They're just yelling no at each other. <laughs> yeah, you know. Burrito and Nova do not want to fight one another, but it's time. Will Nova burn out like the heat death of the sun, or will Burrito be eaten like a delicious Chipotle de burrito? Burrito, let's find out. Yeah, let's see. We've seen this matchup quite a few times. Mm -hmm. We can see it again. Yep. Ooh! Great. I blocked some Nova. Oh, I that JH went over that. Yeah. That's so. <laughs> that's so ballin', dude. I love it. Just, just raise those legs up like you're a plane taking off. <laughs> oh, okay. Great confirm here. Oh my God. It's gonna hurt. Oh my, Ooh, my gosh. Wait, okay. Oh, okay. I was going to say that almost. Yeah. <laughs> there was an opportunity there for uh, Nova to make a slight Stage comeback. But... Oh my god. I love dragon punches. Yeah. I, I love it. Pretty cool. Nice 5P. That might be one of the best 5Ps I've ever seen from Amelia ever. Amelia? Oh yeah. Wow. The that JP. I hit from oh. really high up. Yep. Catches the air button there. That's like the only time you're gonna beat Soul Jake like that. You gotta catch it while it's start mode. Yeah. <laughs> before it's gonna stab you. Before it stabs oh you. Oh my god. JH comes out here, aka the Bro OS. And now we we'll get the I feel out. like and I don't know how. But like Nova's superpower is opponent drops combo and I do an air throw. Yeah. <laughs> It's, it's, oh my god! The enemy oh. superpower. Oh no! Same versus the first. Getting hit with a pin at the end. I uh. They did chip damage. Yeah. I'm almost certain that was chip. Yeah, there was no way that Nova was ready for that after that uh, awkward uh, tech situation. Alright, so once again, going back at it. Burrito up one against Nova. For the opportunity to fight Soup at the end, and I hope it's Burrito, because uh, Burrito and Soup would be great, because they're both Boston Brewery, uh sponsors in there as well. <laughs> oh my gosh, actually baits it, hard baits it. 
get a counter hit there. Nas will confirm reverse, unfortunately, but that was still very, very good. Now that rush is on here, just pushing right, right into the corner. Just slowly Ooh, but yeah. burn the meter. Oh, oh my god! Hit, Empty low, I love that. That was sick, actually. We've got corner to corner like three times Ooh. with no run oh! offensive. Very unfortunate whiff on that close lag. <laughs> what the heck? Right, Nova, Nova's cooking. Oh <laughs> my god. Oh my god, yo. That was like first frame available. That DB ripped. <laughs> oh, whoa. I can't believe Nova did get... that DP perfectly. <laughs> Terry Bogart, KOF 98 cracks you. Good impression. Yeah. Oh, nice empty jump. <gasps> what a good roll, though. Oh my god. What did Pat Benatar say? Fire away. <laughs> Do not ask why I keep mentioning Pat Benatar. <laughs> I'll, I'll ask later. Oh no! Oh, I just like that. Oh, that would that would be pretty bold. I mean, the last hit is usually what you're aiming at. Yeah. If you try to do the, the hits before, you're just gonna die. Cause if you miss it up, yeah. That, yeah, that's that's unscaled damage. That's uh, <laughs> that's yikes. Cause they're not even gonna have the gravity scale by the hit count at all. Mm -hmm. On top of the guard part. Right. All right. Let's see the adjustments Burrito can make here. All right. I'm liking it. He's feeling out. He's just looking for a moment. I yeah. thought he has one hit, you know. Just run to the JH, and if you do, it's your fault. <gasps> nice right stamp right over the 2k. Mm hmm. And then uh, dashes back over again for a mix up for the Hokuzime. Holding on to this 25. Oh, break it from as well. Oh! oh. JH! <gasps> Runs okay, right JH into the cannot go over there. It, no. Very ambitious, very lofty. Ah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wait, was that Chip? That I, think been chip been. I think it might have been. I think it might have been. Good, good bait. You just forgot the part where you have to, like, not die to Chip. <laughs> yeah. That's some burrito. Oh, nice 5B as well. JD, JD, JD. JD, JD. Nice. Yeah, great confirm. Got the needle back as well. And, ooh, punch on the way out. There it is again. As you called it out before. <laughs> RC far slash. <laughs> that might have been a bit simple. That's really unfortunate. <gasps> oh, that oh, was good. Yeah, it goes, it goes low. I don't think he's represented that at all this set. So that was no. a really good, really good spot to do it. Yeah, they explain that like this land into you know the, the loving feet of soul bad guy. <gasps> what a burst bait as well with a neutral jump. Gonna confirm off of this as well and just DPs again. Yeah, you gotta send it. Whoa. Gotta show his boss. Oh my god! Wow. I'm a little bit surprised. Yeah, me too. I was I thought that DP ender was gonna whiff for sure, but it caught her like the very end of her leg. Nice block. Nice block. Oh my gosh. And there's no pin on the burrito side here. Okay, now there is. <laughs> Nova was so kind to push burrito all the way back to the pin. <gasps> oh, he let it rock too. He didn't cancel because he knew. I had to get under it. Mm -hmm. Not last long enough. That's it. That's not it. No oh. combo. Oh. FS. Yeah, there oh, it is. Oh, yeah, yeah. 5P always doing the work out there if you want to try tech. Uh, not very high. Good stuff there to burrito. So that means Burrito will be going up against Soup in the uh, loser quarterfile side here. So now we have all that's left. X Phantom and Death on the winner's final side. And on the two losers, loser quarters, uh, losers quarter finals matches, we have Izzy versus Rumper and Soup versus Burrito. And once again, as a reminder here, we are playing for points because uh, th this is our fourth season of running these online ranking battles a week on the, as a weekly series. So we still have Blaze Blue on Mondays. We have F Plus R, obviously, Tuesdays today. And then uh, Uni 2 on Wednesdays, also at the same time, 8 p.m. Eastern. 
Uh, so we'll be running this for 10 weeks up until April 3rd. And then every week you'll get points for your respective games. You'll be placed on a points leaderboard on your weekly placements. And then the top eight from each leaderboard will be invited to the finale on April 20th. And the prize for winning the burst limit season for each game will be a trip to the regional beach episode with the room and board included. So there's a lot more on the line. There's a minor sort of sponsorship for this one for all the winners out here. So definitely people are putting their best foot forward to get on that top eight board so they have an opportunity to win that uh, nice trip to beach episode. And once again, big ups to beach episode for uh, hosting this again. Boston Booby as a whole, but beach episode also hosting as a whole. That's their yearly regional event up in Boston. And the third one's gonna be a two day event August 10th through the 11th, 13 mainline games from Street Fighter 6, Tekken 8, Smash Ultimate, Under Night 2, all the cool gears. We got the Blaze Blue Central Fiction, the Melty Blood, King of Fighters 15, the Grand Blues Rising, and Sailor Moon S with a lot of space for bringing your own console. So definitely check out start.gg slash beach for more information. Looks like we're getting Izzy up here first. I guess Rumper. The beach doesn't work. The beach is fake. <laughs> can I can I just tap it over there and uh, do that? Sweet. Let's do that. I got you. All right. Rumpers in here versus Izzy. And Rumpers been doing a very very good job of you know. Showing a lot of movement as an option to make sure that the opponents can't get in, and a lot with like a lot of neutral buttons that might not work so well against Cliff as a whole, thanks to kind of the general size of Cliff's buttons. So I expect we to see a lot more of that movement ability that Rumper was using yeah, in previous matchups that kind of work very well. Jam really, really, really has to move cleverly. This is a pretty, pretty competitive, I'd say. Pretty, pretty even matchup. These characters kind of just delete each other if they hit. Mm -hmm. Like, Jam disables dodge and more or less one good counter hit. Cliff disables Jam if he 2Ds her and he has meter. Because she gets hit by like a million good Cliff combos and it hurts really bad. Ooh. So it's it's a very volatile matchup. So I, I'm excited to see how Izzy and Rumper play it out. Yeah, one important thing too is that Cliff can just 2k meaty jam and it will actually beat both DP and carded DP. Ooh, that is so rough. So she, she does have to guess on Cliff Okazemi. Mm -hmm. A little more than other characters, even when Cliff is like directly in her face. Mm -hmm. yeah, this, yeah, this is what it looks like, yep. Yep. Because again, Ryujin will not hit standing Cliff. Oh, good air throw! Oh my god. Yep. Oh. <laughs> yep. Is so you gotta come waiting? to me. Yep. 5k is another button. Really? For Cliff. Yeah, it, it trades almost everything she has, but you know how 5k is on trade. Mm hmm, yeah, that pops over to the air. <laughs> Completely uncheckable. Nice. Oh, but. That's parry. Oh, the overhead! Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah, no, you can't do that versus Jam. You gotta just do the midi lows. Oh, the dodge chop. No punish. Oh, no. Oh, there oh, it is. No, no. Oh, my gosh. It actually got the wall as well. I didn't think it was going to reach from that far. Yeah, this is one of the situations that everything Rumper has, does, has done to approach Izzy has just not been the correct answer here. But this is going to be some good damage. Finally, make it past the letters there. Thanks oh, no, the OTG. Yeah, putting out 236P just wants to prevent any approach. Hmm. Get her ready to get over maybe something that Cliff would have done, maybe a 2D or something like that, but doesn't work, unfortunately. Nice parry. Great Good block. Oh, big oh. FS. Yep, there it is. Is he playing like unbelievably zen right now? Oh, what a 5H. Oh, my, oh my goodness. Gosh. Yeah, right into the corner. Yeah, 5H also just hits versus Jam a lot. <gasps> nice pickup. Wow. He can stun. Oh no, oh, drops! Didn't believe entirely, but that's absolutely fine. This is still, like, that is an insane, insane. That was a really, really good pickup, yeah. Yeah. All right. And Rumper looking to make up for that as well here with my 50% of their own. 
Oh, JS returns. Yeah, really good against Cliff. He's trying to come down like that. <sighs> oh my gosh. Unfortunate drop. Oh. Very that good. 6P drop too, I think, is what caused it. Because mm. that was the round right there. Ooh. The Gekki ran over the 2D. Yeah, good stuff there. JS doing the... Just staircasing Izzy down. Uh oh Nice jump ID. Oh no, misses the 2S. Ooh. You really can't be doing those JSJ strings without being really careful against Jam. Mm -hmm. Just because of parry. Ugh, like the micro dash pressure. Great air oh, throw. Great throw. Now yeah, doing the burst safe. Yeah. Yeah, the distance from Izzy that is keeping from away from Rumper has been just absolutely oh, on yep. point here. But it's crazy how good Rumper has been doing about using uh, the puffball as like a reaction to Izzy. Yeah, instead of just trying to swing out preemptively. Mm hmm. All right, let's see if Izzy can adapt. Mm -hmm. She might have to speed it up a bit, but in different ways. Yeah, let's yeah, see. just more like speeding up in different areas. And just like figuring out, okay, where's Rumper approaching from this point on? Oh, well, you, you could also just do that. That's true, uh, yeah, you're that, right. Yeah, that works. You know, sometimes yeah. the intent to murder can be just displayed very clearly. Yeah, just just, just kill them. <laughs> nice, oh yeah, yeah. Oh my god. I think we just have to kill oh, this guy, Oh, a Cliff. drop. <laughs> that combo's pretty tough on Jim. That's 5H. Mm. That's the FD. Good on Rapper for recognizing. Oh, catches Ooh. the FS, but no big punish. Yeah, that Gekker was doing a lot of work for uh, Rumper's approach to uh, Cliff as a in general matchup, honestly. Oh, yep. Just chilling out. I'm under it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm under it. I'm over it. Oh, no. Misses the parry, I think. Ooh. All right. Is he fighting back? Mm hmm. Nice JS to interrupt that Geki Rin there. Oh! oh and nice throw again here. Nice snake down to the corner. Oh, what a good parry can't. though! You can't, yeah, can't do that to your meaty highs. At least not like that. Yeah. Oh, great air throw! Oh, misses the uh, meaty though, unfortunately, but still able yeah, to get pressure. Yeah, there and take we go. The He's not using JH at all. Just throw. Land and throw. Mess with their timing. Right. Oh, oh yeah, hard to see does. Yeah, just got way the hell out of here. So I don't want this business. <gasps> nice JD. Oh, oh my god. Uh, and back that shot. Charging it. Yep. 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 Now you have to yep, reuse well. this at the right time. <gasps> oh, it was not the right time, unfortunately. This is all T 5s fault. Okay. <laughs> Oh, oh, dear. <laughs> okay, get me off the commentary table when Rumpers on. I, I don't think I'm allowed anymore. I, I'm banning myself. I'm, T5 ruining everyone. I, oh. <laughs> oh, nice 2D! All right. Yes, great 2D. Great round start. And then the 2B is right in turn here. Blocks a gold burst. So actually, they're very good position here. The one weakness of pressure. Wake Up Gold Burst, despite being like a really good option as Cliff, is also that you're Cliff. Yeah. Like, people are definitely going to be looking for that. Right. Above all else, because, you know, Cliff with 100 meters is pretty scary. Mm hmm. Cliff players understand that that's a game winning situation, basically. Yeah, it is, it is vital. If I ever have that, I mean, like, oh, no, you oh, got oh, yeah. yeah, just going to go for the kill there with the JD. And I think that that burst being down like that is going to be a big problem here. Mm -hmm. That gold burst might have been a little overzealous. It's... Oh, there we go, the tick throw. Yep. Oh, no, 2S. Oh, there was a drop tip. It's okay. Nice, Snape. I really want to see more meaty 2K. I think Izzy's really got to put the... There we go. There we are. She heard me. In her ear. Yeah. <laughs> nice. There we go. No, I went for the impossible dust. Did not get it. Could have just killed with the regular dust throw. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Went for a throw. Uh, that hit? Yeah. I guess it didn't finish the combo, so I guess it was a. Uh, yeah. Oh, no, that's big. Gotta be careful. Press it against. Oh, we got the big letter. 
<laughs> Alright, big chunk is actually not helping out. Oh, much. nice JD! Alright, so Rumper is gonna have burst back before this round is over pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. it's still a little uphill for Izzy here, but. Yeah, like you said, Izzy needs to move a little bit faster this matchup and everything like that. And it seems to be working out pretty Nice first well. beat! Oh no! There's a lot of damage up to here as well. Once again, JS the God for Rumper. Yes! Yes, the letters! God's plan! Oh my you god. You just wasted your card in Ryujin! Look at the letters! <laughs> <laughs> oh, what an air throw! Oh no! Wait, can parry? Oh no. Oh my god. Yeah, now Ooh. they're really playing it patiently here. They don't want to make that nice, mistake. Nice, that's it! Never mind. The drill! That, that'll do it! 2-1! Oh, yeah, that move is so freaking fast. It is! And disjointed! I was I sorry I didn't say anything because I was holding my breath. Yeah. <laughs> I mean you didn't win that uh that Oscar for nothing. Exactly. <laughs> I picked up on exactly what you were saying almost instantly. <laughs> almost instantly. Yeah, a little slow. Took yeah. A Three frames. It it was it was a five K. You're right though. But yeah, with that, that means uh, Izzy will be moving on into uh, loser semifinals against the winner of Soup and Burrito. All right. Yeah, it's going to be a... Uh... Wow. Soup versus Burrito. I'm excited. Dizzy Millia, my favorite. <laughs> Actually, yeah, this is another one I've seen so much. I'm very educated on this one. Not only have I seen it, I've, I've, you know, cumulatively collected the perspectives of of both Dizzy and Millia players to okay. deliver the least biased assessment of this matchup possible. All right, all right, let's hear it. Uh, more or less, if Dizzy get hit in air, oh god, oh bad. If <laughs> Millia get hit on ground, I'm dying. <laughs> is is the I think personally that this is the collective will of the people as far as this matchup is concerned. I can so I can let, let's that. see how it plays out with soup here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Jack, making sure the people know that uh, he has eaten two burritos today and will not say anything about what kind of they are. I think that's Ooh. just a uh, BM. Yeah, roll throw. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, but can't get the full confirm here, so Super's able to fight their way out of the corner. Micro Dash 2K, Grand Blue Fantasy versus. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Uh oh. Wow. And this sound starts, sound starts. Mm -hmm. Dizzy throws you back into the corner. Super Saiyan Eddie. Oh, good blocks! Uh -oh. oh wow, JK's Kills on the, the fish. fish. There. Yeah. yeah, that's good. And even yeah, jump kiss on the fish was like a smart idea. Well, that fish aimed the wrong way. Yeah, the big thing. Oh, that was a great throw. The big thing for me. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> <don't know. laughs> the big thing for Milia is that. Anyways, the big <laughs> thing for Milia is that if Milia can knock down Dizzy. It is pretty dire for Dizzy. Mm -hmm. But that situation has to occur. Yes. And Soup is going to be playing really, really, like, in a way that did not let that happen, I do. Nice. Yeah, here we go. Pressure reset. Oh, that's going to hurt. Big damage. One more guess. It's low. Oh, oh <laughs> my god. Oh, holy oh, cow. Wait, hold on. A bar 5D, my goat? Yeah, the whole For real. Okay. Burrito kind of cracked. All right, oh, no, my meter. That. Might run out. Yep. Yeah. That was... Oh, man. I was so excited. 6P, 5D. Who, is it? Who would ever? Yeah. <laughs> Burrito would ever. Mash 6P out of Hitstun. Honestly? Honestly. Milia 6P is one of those buttons you definitely can do that with sometimes. Mm-hmm. 
but not in the 5D. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> that was some advanced sending it. Oh, nice. Yeah, it gets the pin right in the foot. Ooh, a little too far away for the uh, knockdown. Unfortunately, the 2D. Yep, punishes the fish. There we go. Nice. Oh, the chase down from Burrito is so good. But mm -hmm. The hits are not adding up yet. That's the big problem. Oh! Oh, okay. Ooh, try to keep the fish. Doesn't work, unfortunately. Oh, but this is perfect. All right, can we get the knockdown and some Okazemi? We absolutely can. Oh, oh, maybe not. <laughs> yeah, even like... Hey, you know <laughs> what? Maybe maybe your burrito's like me. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like, that's what's you. I'm that for Rumper. You're that for burrito. Yeah. All the nice to this. Right. Nice jump by B, but the fish covers it. Good resilience Ooh. from Burrito to not burst. Oh my god. Oh my god. Blocks all of it. Well. Oh, the, yeah, there it is. Oh my god. That was six sniper skills right there. Oh, big air throw. Oh, and but no, not. Unfortunate. Rios has been on a very good defensive tear, by the way. Just not being opened up in a way that's like been super meaningful until now. Uh, but has been playing super well on the on defense. <laughs> Oh wow, what a heartbeat! Oh no! You, you know what? That's actually fine because that means for the next round, uh, Soup just has to hold whatever burrito uh, lands on them. I mean, yeah, not like, this round, apparently. Oh, wait, hang on. Hang on. Oh, it's still good fine. Throw. Burrito's still playing from an incredible position coming into this round. Mm hmm. Oh, what a 2K. Oh my gosh, even based on a throw attempt as well. Ooh. Oh, great JP. Mm-hmm. Right. I'm really watching that burst. It might come back. Yeah, it should come back. So one more opportunity here, but at this much of a life deficit, that is that doesn't feel great ever. That was so close. That dead angle was really key. Oh Great 2D! Alright, stop the What a throw! Great air throw realizing that this was a little uh, go! Oh, wow! Oh my oh, lord! Oh wow! That is, I, I I feel like Super's trying to go for that and just. <laughs> for Did we almost had Garfield. I was gonna say Garfield, you had burst. I was completely ready for it. Hold on. Can Burrito do it? Anything is possible. Ooh, okay. Hopefully with that 2P there, just get a quick knockdown to fish. Alright, the person's on right now here. Okay. He's doing okay job, yeah, this is a good pickup. It's gonna be a reset. Oh, oh, oh. no. Oh good Oh yes! Oh, oh yes! Familiar, at least, I should say. Yeah. <laughs> Not for Soup. Soup is like, oh god, what the hell? Yeah. Oh, brother. Stick. Oh, wait, that was a black beat, huh? Yeah. It didn't look like it would be. I guess yeah, he might... hit FS a little late. Yeah, it might be one of those, like, add just slightly, like, one frame. One frame like black beat, yeah. yeah. Basically a combo. Nice the block. There we go. Oh, oh, I saw the ambition with that close slash. Just a little shy. <laughs> oh, what a great run under. All right, nice little lockdown again here. Nice 5K oh, and the bubble pop! Oh my pump. god, Look at that. that was so good. We yeah, were trying to mix it up there. I like that. Oh, but I like this too. Yeah, pushing it 2S there against the corner. Oh, again. goes high! Oh, that FRC was gross. Off the hair car. Oh, oh my god, Burrito's one hit away. Ah, oh, the JP! There it is. Just fast enough. It reaches down far enough. Yeah, gosh, the perfect mix, the perfect zoning of what was needed in that situation. And Burrito just saw it with like their third eye. That was insanely good. So just absolutely amazing stuff as well.
And, you know, this entire time I've been starting to talk about, like, you know, the stuff that's happening in uh, Boston and everything like that. But I also want to give some much love to Crossover Arc, which is going to be a three-day event hosted in New York City. That'll be at the OSNYC. Because uh, Wasag Gaming and Lunar Phase are joining forces from March 22nd to the 24th, so just a few weekends away. So their main games include Melty Blood, because of course, you know, L Lunar Phase, L Lunar Phase, and, and Melty Blood are actors again, current code, because Lunar Phase. But also Grand Blue Fight Fantasy Versus, and we got Under Night 2, we got Guilty Gear Strive, and there will be side tournaments for Guilty Gear X uh, Plus R, Exard, Blaze Blue, King of Fighters, and. A mystery bracket, bracket, which seems to be spreading across the U.S. now. A lot more people want to do their mystery brackets. So that'll be on March 22nd to the 24th. That's beautiful. Th those all sound so exciting, right? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Very big show list this week. It's very, very hype. But, Always okay. love to see it. But again, as a reminder here, yeah, we are doing still, you know, if you can't get offline and necessarily, we still have the burst limit happening every week. There's going to be a 10 week uh, ranking battle. Once we get all the points together and everything like that, then the top eight will be pulled aside and they'll play in the finals on April 20th, which will then win out a, uh, a flight and ro a room and board for beach episode, which will be happening a little bit later. Uh, I Ryan, remember the dates off the top of my head is not working, so let me just find it. Uh, August 10th to the 11th this year. So that'll be the Boston Regional, and it's their third one, so it's a good time to hop on for that. Let me just do a quick check here over to Match Reno. Do I have to be disappointed? People, um, you all are actually doing pretty good. Still kind of odd that people did not quit both codes. <laughs> I see some people cook that first code, so it's like 19 out of 15 left, and like the second code is like 24 out of 50 left. It's like, damn. <laughs> Look at the screen, 2019, there's an exclam exclamation point, match Reno. Make sure you're contributing the full amount of money. All right, we got X Phantom versus Death. This should be exciting. Haas Milia. This is kind of like a. Uh... A similar theming to the Soul matchup, but I think Haas slugs it up with this character even better. The minute, like, Haas is right next to Milia, it's, well, it's spooky, right? JP, JH, the low jump arc. Mm -hmm. Rocket just snuffs a ton of the grounded buttons. But on, on the defensive end, it's a lot harder for Haas to get out. Yeah. <laughs> Ideally, probably. <laughs> Ideally, yeah. There's a chance, right? You know. Oh, oh that's huge. Oh my god. Now the pressure's on right here. Just uh, oh, oh my, my god. god! That's gonna hurt too. And yeah, using that right. 6P there to be able to go link to that 6K. It's just like, oh my god. The pressure's just going there. There's a flashback as well! Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Cool it. Oh, an guessing. SXP though. Here we go. Nice knockdown to the corner here. And as a reminder, this is winner's final. So this is going to be a first to three set as well. Oh, big hit. Almost for a tech throw. But doesn't quite get it. Mm -mm. Trying to get the corner back here as well. Doesn't work, yeah. unfortunately. Oh, nice JK. So good on the way up. No throw. Ooh. An OTG? Yeah, yep. that's going to be... Wow, I love know. this pressure from Phantom. Rolls right Ooh. over the rocket! Yeah, good awareness from Death there, trying to get out of the corner as fast as possible. And the pressure's on now, pushing Axe Phantom all the way to the other corner. Big damage. Any blocks! Ooh! Great JP sniper out there. That was a fantastic move. Catches him low, and oh. okay. There we go, that's big. That's huge! That means there's no meter on X Phantom's side. And so if Deathmage is able to get their game going quickly, uh, X Phantom's just going to have to hold it. What a oh My god. Death's going to be really, really careful here. The JP right over the pin? Oh, he knew! Oh, <laughs> I think he was <laughs> oh looking god. for burst. And he oh gets it. God. He can't burst that. This burst. Nice. Ooh. What a throw. All right, it's not a good start. Death's got to keep it clean here. Yeah, He's got to be right quite a go. bit. He's really got to look for dead angle. 
Whoa, what the heck? Oh, the... Oh. Like that weight from Phantom, just being careful. Yeah, perfect. Mm -hmm. Runs up and catches the hesitation. The suggest is slowing down, and whenever he slows down like this, sometimes it, you can see the wavering confidence. He's got to be careful. Yeah, X Phantom. It's kind of like someone that actually equate to Mike Tyson is like the moment that you know that fear is scented off the opponent. That's the X Phantom's like knowledge to know. Say, like, I can go in. I can bully this person now. They they flinch just a little oh, bit. The 6K? I see it All right. Now. Here we go. Yeah. Look at. Oh, he's feeling it. He's feeling it. Footsies. Cleanse okay. footsies. Uh oh. That's scary. Yeah, how long can you footsie someone like X-Phantom, who's very good at footsies? What a JP! Going through that. This is a nice safe pressure reset. It's not really over by him, he just wants to hold his momentum and keep his lead. Oh, the gun blaze, though! That hurts. Ooh, okay. 6 feet! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright! Oh, you're him, you're him! Oh my gosh. Try to confirm off the corner there, unfortunately, oh, six feet, the Oh my god, my goodness. Oh, oh god. not quite enough hits, alright. Alright, right, he goes for the super immediately, does it again here. Yeah, taxing sure all that meter, and yep. Yeah, no more meter to speak of, so just kind of has to hold whatever situation follows. Oh. Mm -hmm. Doesn't even try to go for the charge there, just to prevent, you know, maximum damage from happening there. Gets the knockdown. Oh no, I think he messed up the secret garden. Oh, maybe. Oh yeah. my god, JP. Oh. <laughs> yeah, JP into like land into throw as well with a full conversion at the end. Oh! And then yo gun blaze as well. Oh yeah, if he gets counter hit at all. Mm -hmm. Alright, this is good. This is good for Death Mage. Oh, the whiff! Oh. The whiff 2H meaty! Does not get the link. Oh, we send oh. it! Oh, it goes oh, for the second no. one anyway! They sound death based to press the button! I've seen it happen so many times. <laughs> It's happened to me, man. Yeah, I, I, I can I understand. I'm not gonna lie. I I, it's so funny, but it's like, oh, damn. <laughs> you gotta remember this three parts. I think my favorite is when people go to punish it from behind and the level three one comes yeah. out and you get hit from, <laughs> from the back. It's yeah, so that's, good. That's happened to me more than once. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, yes. Certified Hoss Classic. Okay, good burst there. Ooh, oh, maybe not a good burst. Jeez. The stagger pressure resets looking like Slayer. Death is just having a hard time finding his footing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, x is just really good at staying in those very uncomfortable positions for the opponent. Oh, the flashback. Oh, what a great bad moon as well. I'm just keeping a fresh draw here. Just run back to the corner. Level three, so it's a little safe. Oh, oh no, the gun blaze catches. Couldn't reach up the JK, but so it's good death mage. One more opportunity has pin on their side as well. Oh, that's huge. Oh, oh that's no, unfortunate. That's, that's so just unfortunate. really sad. Oh, he saw. It. Yeah. He's reacting to roll. Just fuzzy mash two P at that point. Then makes sense. Yeah, it was a it was a really good choice. JP, whoa, whoa, he crossed up. Yeah, Holy cow. Nice. That's, that's disgusting. <laughs> the button of all time. Oh, but the pin. Oh, tried to pick it up, but the cooldown. JK? Mm. Oh, plays a little bit there. All right, here we go. That's an opportune counter hit. This is what he wants. Oh, no, the combo. Hostage is too heavy. Oh, oh my god, they're trading a few trades. hits here, yeah. But fortunately for Deathmage, Deathmage does have the life lead. Here. Oh! oh my god. Oh no! Oh my god, that was like, that was such a burst throw attempt. Oh my god, yeah, good, holding on to his burst. He's yeah. gotta be really careful here. Catches the gun blaze, looks for burst, does not get it, FB disc. Oh, tries to go slash back, doesn't work, goes for the burst, hero burst doesn't work out. Deathmage is on the board. I think this is the first round that Deathmage has wow, won, but clean. correct me if I am wrong. 
Oh. Oh, 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 that's a lot of damage. Yeah, and no burst from X Phantom side as well here, so there's yeah, a lot this to is, think this about. Is a tough position to play from. All right, Death looking a little bit more confident now. It's good. Mm hmm. I 6k over the 2s? Oh, oh god. Oh my god. Hey, help! My life! Yeah. <laughs> Where'd it go? What? Oh, what a classic JP! Oh my god, I'm playing Hoth now. All right, right, right. Thank you, Jack. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh, good dead angle. All right, yeah. yeah, that was an amazing dead angle. With the the meter, exact oh. right choice. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, able to win out the race against the burst bar. Good stuff to uh, Death Mage. That was 2-1. Yeah. That dead angle was key because at that point, Rocket 2, there was no way for him to really remove the advantage from it. The IB mm -hmm. wouldn't have done much. Right. And that spacing for Milia wasn't favorable, so just dial in the dead angle because Haas can't do anything but like let it rock. And then he gets those plus frames, but that's, that's the perfect time to use Milia dead angle. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Rice run under the JP. Oh, oh your NCRs are forfeit to me. Okay, neutral tech throw. There we go. Putting it on the table. A big life bar lead to try and try to overcome, but very possible. Mm -hmm. Always corner again here. And definitely has been doing a pretty good job opening up X Phantom in the corner as of late. We've been noting that X Phantom's like, defense overall has been pretty good. But uh, Deathmage has actually been kind of locking it down a lot more tightly and catching X Phantom from their escape attempts. Oh! And yeah, this round has gotten really close now. Death has managed to pull that life lead. Oh! Wow, no, oh, that's 2 H. H. I don't think they even. I think they just didn't block that one. They were yeah, standing. it might have just been like a back dash that missed. Yeah, maybe a fear throw attempt, maybe. Nice jump by Bees, but no punish. I'm blazed just, yeah. just to get out of the corner, mm. honestly. Nice. Great block, some Phantom. He was on set point right here. Nice chilling, yeah. I don't gotta I don't gotta go in. You gotta right. come to me. Yeah, I'll put my opportunity. And when I do. Uh... Nice the JP, there it is. What a workhorse button. <laughs> <laughs> just so pivotal, right? Yeah, it does everything. Oh, wow. Throw from that. Oh, there we go. He went for a burst throw. Did not quite get it. Mm -mm. But nonetheless, Death's gotta be really careful here. Oh, that was a great dead angle. You want the corner? Oh, I think he wanted a walk up throw. He hesitated a little bit though. It worked out though. That 2P match was coming in strong. Oh, get the wall off of this. Oh, wall. that's it. That's it. Straight for super. Right? Okay, I was like, yeah, that's it. That's <laughs> I'm for like, sure. Every time I say it, yeah. <laughs> I look at the screen. I'm like, whoa. The game eventually just runs down the meter to zero and just says, oh, you missed. Oh, dang. Oh, shucks. <laughs> yeah, it's just. <laughs> but uh, real quick here, before we go into our next match, just want to give a quick shout out to Fight Kingdom. Uh, it's like going to be a three-day fighting game tournament up in the Courtyard Marriott over in Everett, Washington. So if you're on the West Coast side of things, we've talked a lot about the East Coast side. But if you're on the West Coast side, beating for some plus R action, check the community event. Uh, it's going to be run by Lesbian War Crimes, and that'll be on May 3rd to the 5th. And I know the folks up there are really, really cool up in the Pacific Northwest. So if you've been looking at an excuse to go to Seattle or Seattle-adjacent areas, uh, that is absolutely the place to go. Check out Fight Kingdom. It's going to be a great time. If I remember my times correct. I think it was either two weeks ago or three weeks ago. My time might be off, but... Uh, Lesbian War Crimes did take the time to uh, commentate a Boston Blue Beat as well, so much love there, all the same. And so, with that, X Phantom is now winning in grand finals and will be facing off against uh, the winner of Death and the winner of this fault next match between Izzy and Burrito. And we also have. 15 codes left on one of our codes, and then we have 21 codes available on one of our other codes. So if you went to the, the match arena and you only clicked one code, you did it wrong. There's a second code on there for you to mash on. So definitely, if you have the opportunity, just make sure you start clearing that out there. We are so close. For having so many codes this time, we are doing like amongst one of the best uh, I've seen so far. So thank you all so much for 
uh, sharing with other folks, putting the work in to make sure these codes are being claimed. Greatly appreciate it. But I'm back. Just in time! All right. So we saw these two fight earlier. I want to see what Burrito's got this time for Izzy. Mm -hmm. Oh, goes low! Nice air throw! Amazing. Oh, <laughs> That's a classic. <laughs> Happens to the best of us. Oh, gets the dash! Misses the Razzing JK, though. Mm -hmm. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh no no! Jesus though, that was, even that three hits a heck ton of damage. Oh my god! That was really unfortunate. Nice. <laughs> Not wow. Izzy has blocked like every bad move. Right. I don't know just... like what, what like what's what's really going on over there in Oklahoma. Right. What's in what's in the Oklahoma water? I just I just want to know. Like, honestly, I kind of want some of it, but like in selective quantities, because I want to be able to block Milia 6K. Yeah. Because <laughs> I feel like they do that more, you know? Yeah, just just a small regimen of, uh, a, like, one dose a day of Oklahoma water. Duel, Oklahoma Fiji. Mm-hmm. All right, great. I just noticed there, there's a Rakusio there. Wait, what? Okay. Yeah, there's a... There's a taunt post round. Is he starting oh, with Oh, oh, I, uh, I see what you said. I couldn't hear the word you said. I'm like, is that? A oh yeah, rap, yeah. I, okay, yeah. <laughs> that's what the game calls it. I yeah. don't, I don't know what like the formal translated term is. Or at least I was told once, and then PM. I. Forgot. <laughs> I'm toxic. I'm toxic. I'm toxic. <laughs> right, playing round with options here, just trying to make sure that he stays in that corner. Like Bruno now knows that it's like cool. You have to come to me. I'm not going to do anything too overarching or crazy. Oh, I can't reach the 6P there, unfortunately. Oh, no pickup. Oh, the cross oh up. my God. Oh, my God. Yep, that's, yep. Boy, that was that incredible. like a real combo, didn't it? That was beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> like, well, surely this will hit OTG and not do enough damage. Nice no, throw. Great oh, goal big as well. Danger on the field here. Gonna use that secret garden to try to keep Cliff out as much as possible. And these ones have been crazy for Burrito. Oh. Oh, and again with another throw. Alright, knock down here again. Waits it out here. Goes for the chop at that point. You might as well. <laughs> yeah, I think it's it. Yeah. They're really able to take the first one here against uh, Izzy. This is still first to two. We're not quite at the the finals here yet. Mm-hmm. So yeah, Izzy's going to have to make some quick changes. Yeah, it's very possible that we get a Milia loses final match. Nice air throw. Oh. oh, goes for the conversion. Doesn't quite get it. Good awareness, yeah. though. Yeah, good to try at least. All right, no good throw in the corner here from Burrito. Has been hitting those quite a bit, actually, against Izzy. Oh, great dash under 60. Oh, big combo. Get this kill. All right, Nape Saddle's over here. He takes the corner back. This is actually very, very important here. Now, if you just open it up, oh, here we are, but Yo, oh, messes up dust. again. Izzy's going to get that in like another week or two, and everyone's going to be screwed. I mean, she hit Jacob Pat with it. It's a little easier on uh, midweeks, though. <laughs> so two weeks. All oh, these air throws. Oh, big counter hit combo I don't here. Know what that counter hit. Does he? Oh no, another five D. Gets here it. That's go. a stun. Yeah, yeah there it is. And then the that was come sick. On. Oh, that combo looks so cool. <laughs> That's all she wanted. She just wanted to hit that in bracket. Right. 
And which, once again, great practice because uh, it's going to be very important later on as you know, get more into these tournaments and everything. It's like, cool, have that very consistent Yes, round. the letter. Oh, look in the 5H. Yeah, Amelia has, has no pin here. Mm -mm. Oh, it's Amelia's primary air. timing mix-up that beats 5H, which is pin. This is not on the table. Nice dodge. Ooh. Where's the pin? Oh, the overhead catches. That's going to hurt. Oh, my oh back. the back broken. Oh, and he tries throw. to go for the throw and doesn't work out, unfortunately. So that would put Burrito 2-0 against Izzy. All right, I know there's two millions on the screen and going to be no cliffs, but uh, cover for me for a bit here. I will be right back. You got it, sir. Thanks, boss. All right, I'm excited. I'm really curious how these two are gonna square off. Here we go. So this mirror is really, really, really volatile, really fast paced, and just kind of violent. Let's see what, what death starts up with. Nice micro dash 2k. Agrito checks it. All right. Goes low, gets the hit. Oh, what a 6 speed. Oh, the turbo ball. All right. Wait, Burrito's kind of cooking. Oh, counter hit. That's big. Yeah, that's a perfect first round. Wow. Damn. All right, Deft. What you gonna Jeez. fire back with? Yeah, God. I saw the end of that. Yeah, it was pretty brutal. Ooh. Oh my God, the end here is... All of Burrito's have hit and all of Deft's have whiffed right now. Great defense with Burrito. They're actually running in and often defend. That's actually a Ow! Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, oh whoa, whoa. no! No burst. I will not be giving you that. Oh, can't put it from there, unfortunately. So there's a little bit of an opportunity here from Burrito. Oh. What the heck? What a clash. Wow. Oh! All right, there's a corner here as well. Death Mage does have a hundred meter almost to speak about. Oh, fuck, I guess it doesn't matter when you don't get knocked down. All right, dead angle. Oh my gosh, Bates out again with the pin here. One more mix-up, we'll do it. There it is, that oh, was what yeah, we were talking yeah. about earlier with the meter. <laughs> just didn't get the knockdown to you know, talk about it. Yep. Ah, the six P's. Now they're all hitting. All right. <laughs> Big rhythm check. Oh no! Unfortunate drop. Oh, Bates. What's her run up throw? Does not get it. Oh! Looking for burst. What a JP. Oh, pushes him back into the disc. That was sick. Mm -hmm. Oh, big JD. Oh. <laughs> what? Man, oh my god! The corner here. Oh my god. Oh wow. That is. Uh oh. Okay, this is looking really, really hard, rough here. That's actually huge. Yeah, they're just dashing around here a little bit. Oh, oh yeah, past the yeah. burst. Understandable.
Yes, that was a <laughs> that was a whew. that was spooky at the end there. Yeah, that was a that was. And a to lot. think it's first to three. Yeah, they really have the opportunity to really learn each other's play styles and how they want to outmillia one another. So now he's just trying to push towards corner here. Death may just get an early lead. Ooh. Gosh, right now, Death Mage just really has this under control here. Burrito had a few good setups against uh, Death Mage, like forcing some counter hit stuff and everything like that, but now Burrito just has sheer control. Oh, what a burst! They'd be a little greedy. Mm -hmm. Does not want to give up this round, though. Oh my god, the conversion again with the force break. Uh, can we guts crush? <gasps> oh. I said it. I said it. I shouldn't have said you anything. Did, you did? I, yeah. It always happens. I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's shaker would have done it. Whoa, they both 2D'd, I think. Did, did Millia 2D beat Millia 2D? Wait. I, I have this replay. I can look later. Yeah, it's true. Oh, there we go. Confirms. My god. I uh, can probably wait a little bit here. Oh, it actually doesn't burst the, the Seer Garden. Yeah, Maria's not going to have an opportunity Air to winger? burst here. Is this a real oh, move? Yeah. Wow. Uh-oh. The winger in the day? Yeah, the air winger was in the game. I, I forget that, too. It's like, it never comes up in anything. Oh! Oh, okay. oh the JK again? Oh, my oh God. Oh, my God. Wait. Wait, whoa, well, stuns? Stun what the fuck? Bad Moon RC, huh? JD to knock down. Brother? One more mix will do That's it. That's not real. Oh, wow. We barely oh, did not do it. I'm sorry. Bad Moon RC exploded my brain. I was... Yes. What? <laughs> I've never seen that. Holy and he crap. built the meter back. Mm -hmm. Because I guess the tension pulse is just that high. Wow. Heaven or hell, this is Sector versus Cyrex. <laughs> this is a... Uh... Oh. McDonald's versus Wendy's, I guess. I don't oh. know. Oh! <laughs> Maybe a birthday. Oh, lands on it! Boo! 6k! My god, yeah, Death Mage has been controlling this matchup. Like, like even like the most nuanced escapes like that, Death Mage is just standing in the right position to cover all of it. Another opportunity here for Burrito jumping out of the corner here, but just JP into a landing J or 6K. Yeah, that was beautiful. Oof. This has been rough for Burrito. What? Hey. Oh, wow. Do they pin immediately? Maybe expecting Death Mage to come in a little bit sooner, but just throws it to the ground and just loses that option. Oh. FB disc into blocking. Pretty strong. Right. And uses the uh, false defense to push uh, burri or that Burrito out. And now gets the corner once again. And I think this is one big thing about Death Mage. Like, Death Mage has been using all their meters oh, for, like, throw. converting back into the corner there and just, like, really keeping to the corner with the force break. And Burrito's just not really been getting an opportunity to use it as much. And where they do use it seems to be more defensive, I guess. Oh, my God. There we Burrito. go. Burrito's still alive. Burrito fighting back. That's a that's every that's every burrito in my life nowadays. <laughs> Does not want to die. I mean, it's spooky. It looks like it's these are all really close, but Deft is just pulling ahead a little bit. But mm -hmm. Burrito, oh, that was a great chase on that back dash. Yeah, this might be the opportunity that the first of three really uh, bites in the ass against Death Mage, who's been ruling the matchup up to this point here. But maybe Burrito is learning something. Yeah, the, the longer these sets go, the more time. Mm -hmm. Oh, the black beats. Oh. Mm, oh that is a dead angle. Gets the Okazemi. Oh, frame trap. Oh. Buttons. Oh, oh no. Just couldn't make the most of that clash. That was a throw. I know it was. Mm -hmm. On a 5P, but no pickup. Okay. Uh, the air throw there from Death Mage. Keeping it alive here, actually. 
Oh. Wow. Yeah, that, that was an opportunity for Burrito to really make a comeback there. It was looking pretty darn good, but Death Mage just turned it up another level and just keeps on wheeling and dealing all the way up to Grand Finals here. Coming from the loser side against X Phantom, who will be uh, representing the winner side. And this is going to be a rematch from before as well, where X Phantom beat Def 3 1. Yeah, Def is going to do a lot of, a lot of big changes to, to turn that around. Cause... Mm hmm. He got like he got a game. He looked he looked like he was getting more confident finding his footing, but then Phantom just turned it up way too much, you know. Right, right. But you know, as so we were saying a little bit earlier, as long as some of these matches kind of go on and everything like that, um, the better it kind of just you know you you start learning your opponent and everything like that. Yeah, don't don't underestimate them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, give him time, right? You gotta you got time to date the data. But six wins is a big ask. Mm hmm. Especially against X Phantom. Not many people have, over the course of like the last two years, has managed that. One of the only ones, weirdly, in recent memory was Jacob Pat because of that bracket reset. Right, right, exactly. And even then, I don't even know if he won six. He might have only won about three, if I'm not mistaken. I'd have to look back, but it, it's <laughs> six in a row against Phantom, or even just six, you know, cumulatively. Right. In a set cow like this, that's tough. Mm -hmm. All right, the Phantom appears, and now we have Mage versus Phantom. Sounds pretty uh, JRPG like. It's true. These are like classes, right? <laughs> it's my FF5 mod. This is my this is my RO uh, crew. <laughs> the X Phantom just unlocked a new class with my Mage class. Alright, let's see it. Here we go. Let's look at the round start. I really want to see how they feel it out. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. two piece. He wants to check that forward movement. Yep, definitely right. back it up and say, no, no, no. Not, not letting you get the first hit. Also, big thing for Deft here. He's playing hot, you know, just coming from all those losers runs. Phantom's got, got to warm up. Mm -hmm. Oh, what a pickup. All these end ears. They're all landing. Oh my god, yeah. Phantom nice. has not been able to land yet. Is a 5P? He head gets the pickup, nice. Using the rocket just to close the distance. Right, that's like some ST style stuff there. Use a special move to just get right back in. <laughs> I don't know if that was on purpose, but it worked great. Ouch. Nice throw. Oh, it doesn't get the wall, just barely. Wow, the yeah. 5P. I don't know what it caught. Maybe a low JS or a JK. Yeah, really, it was like a JP, honestly, but May just got underneath uh, Millia enough to make it not count. Nice close flash. Oh! oh. And I God. have to say, X Men has been doing a really good job using that FD back here against uh, Death May specifically. Just the range has been working so well. Yeah, every time so far this set, which granted twice, but that's still two for two on the counter hits, which. Hey. And that, that has a counter hit starter, that is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice dead angle, yo. Yo, it goes low after, it doesn't even go for the link. Yeah, I just knew that you got hit, it's like, cool, now you have to guess my, uh, this is a new kind of 50-50. Yeah, just to see if, you know, you're paying attention, right? Mm -hmm. Are you down backing or are you holding back or are you holding up? Right. I'm gonna find out. And yeah, once again, like you said, X-Fan really plays by feel. And so by just kind of sniffing out and say, okay, here's what I'm feeling like you're going to do. You're not going to strike back. You're not going to press anything. You're not going to yeah. try to escape crazily. You're just going to sit there and be like, well, I got hit by that thing. For some nerdy stuff, if that was a meaty 2H, that 2K would have caught pre-jump even if Death was, was holding up. Oh. Literally so would have hit him the, 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 third, the third exact frame. Mm -hmm. Oh, mm -hmm. crouches under that IED reset. I... Good FD though. Pushes him out. Just wants to get some space. I need to move. Oh my god. Unfazed. Mm -hmm. Phantom's really willing to trade a lot of health just taking little residual chip hits in. Just to just to get next to Milia because that's where Hosh performs so good. Oh god. Yo. Oh my goodness. What a confirm. Right? 
And yeah, like, I like how the X Phantom used the uh, 2S to kind of like say, okay, here's a check button. And ran in and then did another check button, like, right in front of Death Mage's face. That's how fast X Phantom is moving in this matchup. Finally representing Wake Up Throw against the catch when it's not quite nice. Run Up Throw again. It's gonna do not very much damage, but Death's really just looking to get into the corner. Right. Nice, there yeah. we go. Death Mage doing a great job of opening up X Phantom over and over here. One more could do it. Oh, but the 2P Abare. Oh. <laughs> oh. <gasps> nice JS. Oh my goodness gracious. Yeah, after an instant block on the pin as well. What a good response from X Phantom. Oh my god, it beat this. That's oh stunned? My gosh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> we were talking about uh, Death Mage coming in hot from uh, the Losers Final Match and everything Yo, like um, that. But, I'm oh. sorry. Oh, he switches to Johnny. Oh. So, Death used to be a Johnny player back in the day. This is where okay. he started. Okay. Okay. Let's see if he's got it still. Yeah, because he got the swag. Oh, big 5K. Here we go. Yeah, maybe the bravery will just be enough to make that extra. Nice. Oh, my God. He's catching. All right, 5 h doesn't quite find his mark there. IB jumps out. Oh no, Divine Blade doesn't quite get it. Mm -hmm. All these 5Ks every time. Yeah, it's working out here. It stays relatively even. And the defense still stays strong here. Then, you know, might really have something against X Phantom. Just gotta really get this conversion going. Trying to keep it as much as possible here. Nice, nice. backdash, oh. JK. Oh, but Rocket's in. Oh my gosh, FRC. He spent all that meter. Yeah. Switch he... RC Fafnir. Jeez. XM's got oh. places to be. He's like, I got work in the morning. Like, it's 10 p.m. I need to go to bed. That's like the funniest <laughs> high low I've ever seen. Right? Why not? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's counter hit. Oh my gosh. Help. Johnny has not seen the ground in years. To be fair, Johnny's kind of okay flying around. I mean, true, he is, he is a jellyfish pirate. And there is a character, there is, there is a technique called the flying Johnny. Oh, what a 2D! <laughs> That's true. Oh, God. Uh, oh, Killer Joker, but no pickup. Oh, my gosh. Nice. Oh, nice 5k here. Get a coin. Conversion. Can we get a knockdown? Absolutely. And then go. Oh, oh, never mind. Nice tech chase. Up oh coin. my oh, god. No. <gasps> Jumps over the Fafnir FRC to keep this all safe. This is not over yet for Deathmate, but he's looking very, very hard from this point right. onward. Johnny's just got to do the infinite Ugh. meter glitch. Never mind. Plus him in the hat. Die. <laughs> Ow. Ow. My, my brain. My hat. I need that. <laughs> Listen, if somebody punched me in the hat, I'd be pretty upset. Same, like, honestly. That would uh, that would suck. That's my that's my best hat with the with the brim. Well, that is still very good stuff to X Phantom. Congratulations on winning week six of a uh, Boston Booby Online Plus R. Did a, an absolutely amazing job out there, and we want to thank you all so much for hanging out with us, watching some more Guilty Gear. It's been a very uh, active night tonight. Uh, post TNS and once again as a reminder this is a part of a greater series of tournaments that are happening for the next uh, four more weeks where every uh, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday whether you're playing Blaze Blue, Guilty Gear Plus R or Uni 2 on those respective days uh, we're going to be running it up until April 3rd. Each week you'll earn points and from the respective games be placed on the top 8 leaderboard and if you are one of the top 8 by the uh, April 20th then you'll be able to compete for a chance to win room and board over for Boston Blue Beats regional beach episode. Yeah, it's gonna be amazing. Mm -hmm. and All right. You, and for those of you who don't know beach episode, by the way, just is their yearly regional event. Uh, the third one is going to be a two day event in August 10th through 11th. Uh, you, it's all the games that you already know and I've mentioned before alongside with like, you know, the popular ones, C Fire 6, Tekken 8, so on and so forth as well. But most notably, Sailor Moon as hell yeah. You hit that start.gg slash beach for more registration for more information for registration and hotel. Wait, I just got a text from Tato on my phone. You're not gonna believe this. Uh-huh. He's uh -huh. got something special planned for Beach episode. Oh, That's yeah? right. He's got a giant killer man-eating plant 
ready for you if you can take Tato's new challenge. You simply have to not mess up on a DDR extreme difficulty dance track. If you mess up, however, the plant will eat you alive and your remains will be mailed to your nearest relative. Oh. If you win, free room and board the next beach episode. Yeah. <laughs> risk it all for the tournament. If you want to show that you're a true FGC player, you got to risk it all in the rhythm game side of things. <laughs> But as says, for more events over on the East Coast, if you want to go a little bit more offline, since we seem to be uh, hosting one more match against Death Mage and X-Band, and that's fine by me, uh, you can check out Crossover Arc, which will be in New York, which is a three-day event. That'll be from March 22nd to the 24th. So the main lines are going to be, you know, Melty Blood, obviously, with Grand Blue Fantasy versus On Night in Birth 2 and Strive. But there will be side tournaments for Guilty Gear Plus R, Rev 2, Blaze Blue, King of Fighters, and a Mystery Bracket tournament as well. So that'll be worth checking out. And if you're still on the East Coast side looking for more events, the month, Boston Blue Beef Monthly on March 16th will be happening. And that will be uh, with the regular tiles with Blaze Blue, Strive, XR, Sailor Moon, Grand Blue, and all the sort of will be present. Uh, so that will be at Balance Patch. Doors open at 2 p.m. And the Earth's Bracket will be at 4 p.m. So you have a little bit of time in the day if you need to do something before you head that way. And that is sponsored by Junk Food Arcades. Once again, always rocking it with their snack box micros. They have a bunch of collection of controllers that are leverless that can uh, really make your wrist and day a lot better. And if you happen to be on the West Coast, definitely check out Fight Kingdom. That'll be a three-day fighting game event over in Everett, Washington. So if you're looking for more plus R action and a variety of other old school games, you can definitely check that out. It's run by your lesbian war crime, so much shout out to them. And that'll be on May 3rd to the 5th. Destroy. <laughs> beautiful ad read, Ryudo. Thank you. That's simply beautiful. And uh, last chance, by the way, for making sure you hit that match arena before we head off to Minotums here. So if you haven't clicked it already, make sure you do it. Yes, please. We got double codes. Please, you know the codes, please. I'm begging you I'm on my hands and knees. I couldn't, I cannot get any lower. <laughs> don't if make I did, go I would lower. be six feet under. And <laughs> well, I might be if you don't claim all these codes, please. That's right. But then once again, thank you all for hanging out. Greatly appreciate it. We'll see you all next time. Hopefully tomorrow for uni too, but otherwise we'll be back again next week for some more plus our action. We'll see you later. Have a good one over at Minitums. <laughs>